YouTube hello, welcome to the stream. We are back playing WWE 2K23. Got a bunch of new wrestlers, both male and female. So uh hope you're ready for three, four, five hours. I don't know how long we're going today. Of crazy, silly simulation content. Uh we haven't done this for a couple of months. I think last time we did it was for Ray TX in July. So uh I guess the next time we'll do this is in like December or maybe early next year. I don't know. Uh, but hopefully you enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe on the video. Buy something from FrameRateMerch.com and let me know which one your favorite... Wh what was your favorite match or what favorite wrestler you saw in this disaster of a stream that you're going to watch? Uh, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoy. I love you, and I'll see you in a second. Gamers, we're back. There is no audio because of uh, it's all copyrighted, so enjoy the silence. We are starting off with a female... Royal Rumble. Now, I tried to set the settings to 30 seconds, but every time I make sure it's saved, it resets. Yeah, so I don't know if it actually stood at 30 seconds entrance time or what. We're just going to see what happens. Who knows? But uh, let's go. Also, I think my face cam goes up here. Can we get a prediction going, by the way? Who's going to win, odd or even? Here we go. All right, first up, we got Samus against Pokimane, the queen of Twitch. Here we go. She's already gone. Oh, my God. Holy shit, Pokimane sucks. Bro, I didn't even finish writing her name down. Oh, it's saved. Okay, 30 seconds saved. All right, Queen of Twitch is out. Mod check, dude. Mod check, Pokimane. Next is Stacy Keebler. So there's uh, five, four or five real wrestlers. And then the rest are uh, creator wrestlers. I also don't know why the creator of Samus made her eight feet tall. I don't know why she's so tall. All the creator wrestlers are at max stats, so 100 or 99, depending on the wrestler. Sometimes they're cap at 99. I can't believe Pokemon got eliminated so quickly. Oh, Stacy Keebler sticking, sticking in there. Okay. Next up, we got Heather Mason from Silent Hill 3. Here she comes. Here's Heather. She's in. You guys remember when Pokemon was in this? Don't worry, I'm keeping track who's coming in odd and even. So, your predictions? Let's see what the prediction says. 46% even, 54% odd. Okay. Okay. Let me lower that a little bit more. Heather taking a nap already. Keebler's getting it. Samus is going to be hard. Oh, here comes the Wii Fit trainer. She is so swole. Keep your feet moving, and most importantly... She is so in shape, and mo more importantly, she is gray. Time to get physical. Will she use the Wii Fit board as a weapon? Oh, Samus Aran. Stacey Keebler's on the ropes. Big reversal from Wii Fit Trainer. Wii Fit Trainer missed. Never mind. Stacey Keebler, she going over? Uh, she is still... No, I think she's going to roll under. Maybe? Hold on. Wii Fit Trainer? No, I'm sorry. Samus was trying to get her out. All right, next up. We got Jesse of Team Rocket fame. Prepare for trouble, but it's only her, so don't make a double. Jesse is in. Write that down. You know, the fact that everyone is still in the ring makes Pokemon getting eliminated in like four seconds impressive. Hold on one. Okay. Okay. All right, we almost have a full ring. Sam is finally taking a nap. She deserves it. She's been working real hard. Next up is my future wife. Don't tell Tina. Also, I think she just got engaged. Miss Ripley. Rhea Ripley's in. There she is. All right, that's real wrestler number two. Mommy is in. She's already down, though. Oh, Stacy Keebler beating the shit out of Heather Mason. Yo, Heather Mason's like fucking 16 years old. Relax. 
She's a kid, but not a squid. Speaking of Pokemon, Misty is in. There she is. Oh, there, Stacy Keeper's been eliminated. I don't know why the creator made made Misty so pale. What the fuck? She's like turbo white. I don't know why they did that. Listen, I don't ask questions, all right? This was the highest rated one. Stacey Keebler did a great job. Samus is still in. We fit Trader on the ropes now. And We fit Trader's been eliminated. Next up, uh, was it the eighth wonder of the world, China? Rest in peace. Rest in peace, China. China's in. Was it ninth wonder? Oh, wait, there are, there's eight wonders, right? So she'd be the ninth. China is in, and she's immediately lifting up Heather Mason. Now, we can eliminate a wonder. We'll replace it with China. Misty's about to eliminate Rhea. No, stop. Stop. Samus is actually... Oh, no, you know, she, buys, she has a lot of health still. Guys, who do you think was a faster elimination? Pokimane or Santino? From the Royal Rumble. It might be Santino still. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. Next up is Cammy of Street Fighter fame. Cammy's number 10. Oh, why was the screen shaking? Was there an earthquake? Oh, China's up and over. Eliminated by Rhea Ripley. Cammy. Beating up Rhea there. Missy taking a nap. God, she's so pale. It's like a fucking ghost. No, this is Cammy's uh, Street Fighter 6 outfit. Next up is Amy Rose. All the furries in chat, I need you to relax. It's gonna 10,000 bits to yiff in my chat. Amy's in. Cammy doing some kicks to Amy. Oh my God, Samus. Every time I look, take a look at Samus, she is just taking a nap. Heather's getting up. Rhea getting kicked in the spine. Amy's already taking a nap. Ooh. We got one more spot open in the ring. Who's it going to be? Oh. I can't believe Samus is still in. We're almost halfway through this, and she's still... She's still vibing. Oh my god, Missy just kicked her right in the face. Jeez. All right. We might have a full ring. Uh-oh. Here comes Laura Croft. Bunch of English women in the ring. Laura is in. I like how they try to make her face look polygonal. And there goes Amy Rose. Sorry, furries, your time is up. Oh my god, Cammy's just fucking getting it over there. I know, no triangle boobs, right? Oh, Cammy is stunned in the center of the ring. Everyone has a target here. Cammy's taking a nap. Samus is still in. Rhea on the turnbuckle over there. Misty taking some time to get up. Two PlayStation icons beating the shit out of each other with uh, Lara Croft and Heather. Rhea just throwing Jesse like she weighs nothing. Oh. I wonder if it's because she's so tall. Samus may be. Okay, Cammy drop kick nothing. Oh. Samus is two. Pokemon was number one. Is Samus finally going to be eliminated by Misty? Jesse over the ropes, eliminated by Lara Croft. Nope, Samus is still in. Oh, now Heather is stunned. That was a sick move by Cammy. Oh my god, the kick to the mouth of Misty. Ray has been eliminated by Cammy. Here comes Ramona Flowers. Cammy's 
Cammy might be eliminated by Lara here. Oh, that was a reversal by Samus. I thought she was about to get thrown up by Misty. Heather has, like, no health here. Samus's health is looking pretty good, all things considered. Misty's, like, all red right now. Oh, big punch by Ramona there. By the way, whoever wins this, I'll just give, like, the Diva belt to. I was trying to look for a good female uh, belt, but I couldn't find one I really liked. Samus and Cammy double team and Misty there with a fucking suplex. Here comes Aerith. Oh, I didn't write Ramona Flowers down. Whoops. Ramona Flowers. She's alive. She about to get eliminated? She might be eliminated immediately. Oh, there goes Misty. The ghost is okay. And Aerith? Is Aerith immediately eliminated? No, no. She's still in. She's still in. Dude, the shading on her dress. Or is that supposed to be like blood coming down her chest? I didn't notice that when I downloaded The Wrestler. Oh, hey, she's gone. Doesn't matter. Who cares? She sucks. Final Fantasy VII is a bad game. Clementine is in. Clem is in. Sam is still in. Heather and Cam with a suplex, a suplex on Clem. Blonde power. Ramona up and over. Ramona Flowers has been eliminated. Samus is still in. Clementine on the ropes. Almost immediately eliminated. Oh, she's on the ropes. Is Laura Croft going to do it? She's finally eliminated by Laura Croft. We're losing a lot of people here. PlayStation greater than Nintendo. It's been confirmed. Next up, we have Cynthia. She died for our sin. Thea. She's in. A lot of blondes in the ring. A lot of the blonde takeovers happening. Once again, Heather has no health and her body is almost fully red. Jeez, Heather Mason. What is Lara Croft doing? Jeez. Here comes Aloy. Speaking of PlayStation, she's in. It's kind of fucked up that all the creative wrestlers for Aloy forgot her mustache. So, got to get that in the next version of Aloy. Got to make it accurate. Oh, Cammy's been eliminated by Heather Mason. Jesus Christ, that was a violent dropkick. Oh, Cynthia punch. I'm sorry, Cynthia receiving a punch from Aloy. Taylor Swift is in! Oh, dude, she's number 18. Can you imagine if it was... Can you imagine if it... I forgot what her number is. Is it number 17? No. What's her number? Uh, Tina will let me know. Oh, a spear by Taylor Swift! Out of nowhere, it's 13. Sorry. Oh, who just got eliminated? Oh, Cynthia got eliminated. Fun fact, this is my favorite outfit from the tour. All right, Taylor just threw Lara Croft. Oh, she went to spear Heather again. Jesus. Next up is Chun-Li. I added Taylor Swift just for Tina, by the way. I don't know if Tina's still here, but it's, this is just mainly for Tina. What a weird-ass flip. Heather, once again, is stunned in the middle of the ring. Heather doesn't know where she is anymore. She might prefer to be in Silent Hill at this point. She's getting her ass kicked. She's getting eliminations, though. Yeah, once again, I don't know why Chun-Li's eight feet tall. Her thighs need to be massive, not her height. She's just picking up Clementine like she weighs nothing. Jesus. Hatsune Miku is in! Number 20. She's in! 
I can't see who that is. Oh, Hatsune Miku. Oh, my God. Beating the Heather is really just really taking it here. Clementine was dead in the middle of the ring there. Aloy about to eliminate Taylor Swift. Big reversal from Taylor staying in the ring. Clementine on the ropes. Is she going to get eliminated by Chun-Li? Uh, Clementine has been eliminated by Chun-Li. Big DDT from Taylor. Next up is Nikki Minaj. She's in. Nicki Minaj of Call of Duty fame and nothing else. Taylor dropking her right in the face. Let's go to the beach, beach. Oh, Aloy slammed on her goddamn face. Heather going for an elimination on Taylor Swift. I have no idea. She's eliminated. Heather is still in this match somehow. Now she's going for... Okay, no, I think she's going to eliminate Laura Croft right now. Taylor has been eliminated. Heather, no, she is going for another elimination. Heather might have a, a shit ton. I don't know who has the most right now. Maybe Samus. Samus was in for, like, ever. Hatsune Miko's on the ropes, but I think she, uh, or Miku, not Miko. She's back in. Heather has finally been eliminated by Nicki Minaj, but a great, a great effort from Heather there. Aloy is up and over, eliminated by Chun-Li. We are losing a lot of women right now. Holy shit. We're losing a lot of people. These are the final four. No, we, uh, Nicki Minaj was 21, I believe. So we have nine more. We have nine more. Faith Connors. Don't know who she is? She's from a little game called Mirror's Edge. There she is. All right, don't fucking taunt. No one gives a shit about Mirror's Edge anymore. All right. Oh my God, she just kicked Chun-Li right in the titties. She's doing her parkour around the ring. Oh my god, okay. Mirror's Edge 2 any day now? I, I mean, Mirror's Edge 2 exists. Nobody bought it. <laughs> Ada Wong. Mommy be serving and she's coming into the ring right now. Oh, Chun-Li has been eliminated by Lara Croft. Ada Wong in her RE4 remake outfit. Alright, so we have Lara Croft. I think she's been in there the longest. You, I, she has, but you can tell by her health. Hatsune Miku, Ada Wong, Faith Connors, and Nicki Minaj. Lara Croft on the ropes. Getting back in, though. Getting back in. Next up is 2B. We still have three real wrestlers. I'm surprised they haven't come in yet. I think it's three. Two or three? I think it's three. 2B or not to be? Going straight for Ada. Hatsune Miku. Okay, that was kind of jank, but Hatsune Miku gets that drop kick off. Oh, kick to the face. She's a robot. That should break Ada's foot. All right, who's coming in next? Melina! Of Mortal Kombat fame, she is in. Oh, Ada might go up and over from 2B. Ada's on the ropes! Oh, now the help with Laura Croft. Oh, that's bullshit. That's BM! Oh, Laura preventing the upskirt. Appreciate it, so I don't get banned. But Ada Wong hangs on. She hangs on. Unbelievable. Bayonetta! Yeah, the last the last couple of wrestlers are going to be real wrestlers. Speaking of mommy. Yeah, Ada hit the QTE. Ada Wong fighting Bayonetta. Molina in the corner. 2B fighting Nicki Minaj. Uh, Hatsune Miku just, what, her Quranid Faith and, two, and uh, Laura Croft. With the nut buster. Oh, or, or the, the, the cooter clasher on Hatsune Miku. We got ourselves a full ring. The clam slam, if you will. All right, is this, is this finally the end for Lara Croft? She's been in here for so long. Is it finally her time to go? Faith Connors? Oh, no, she is still in. 
as of right now. Oh, Lara Croft is finally eliminated. Holy shit. What an effort. What an effort. Faith Connor just slammed into nobody there. Okay. Two B has been eliminated from Nicki Minaj very quickly. Melina taunting. What's she gonna do? All right, just Irish whip Ada Wong into the corner. Nicki Minaj on the ropes. Faith missed. Oh, eliminated by Hasuni Miku. Nicki Minaj is gone. Is it time for Melina to go now? Nope. Oh, oh, Melina. She's hanging in there. No one coming to help Melina. Is Ada Wong going to get an elimination? No. Shout out to 2B and Nicki Minaj slowly walking out of the ring. Oh, Faith is gone. Faith has been eliminated. Just like that, we have four ladies in the ring with four slots left. I think it's one creative wrestler and three real wrestlers. Yo, someone throw that guy a shirt. Oh, you can't see his sign. It says, throw me a shirt. My face is protecting it. Trish Stratus. Everyone had a crush on Trish Stratus. If you didn't, you're a liar. And she still looks amazing for her age. What's Ada doing? Oh, okay, just standing there. At the very least, you had a crush on Trish. You might still have it to this day. Melina! On the ropes. She gonna get eliminated? Angelica Pickles! Here she comes! She's in! And immediately slammed by Trish Stratus. Angelica's like, what, five years old? Uh, what's she doing in this ring? Where's Cynthia? She doesn't have her doll. Oh, that looks painful. I don't know what the hell Bayonetta is doing. All right, second to last entrant here. Lita! I think that's the last real wrestler. Oh, Hatsune Miku's been eliminated by Ada! Oh, that's a weird glitch. Lita's legs didn't load. $70 game, by the way. Hatsune has finally been eliminated. Angelica on the ropes. Is she going to get eliminated by Lita? She is! Angelica's out. I picked the wrong pickle kid. Okay, Lita missed that big time. All right, your last entrant. It's none other than Barbie. The last one. Barbie is in. Bayonetta is just vibing on the ropes. All right, here are your final six. I forgot what number they all came in on, so I don't know if the... Oh, my God. Barbie got kicked out of nowhere. Oh, Bayonetta just got eliminated. Okay. Who's been here the longest? Ada Wong, I think? All right, here's your final five. <laughs> okay, all right, Michael Cole saying monkey flip is so funny. Oh, insta-stun on Lita. Melina swinging at ghosts, apparently. Barbie taking a nap. Oh. Lita just lost in the sauce. What's up, Sir Teapot? How are you? Lita and Melina. Might go over. Let's see. Trish just watching. Rightfully so. Just take your time. Recover your breath. All right. Lita coming back. And Melina has been eliminated by Barbie. Oh, big kick to Trish's face. All right. Lita's just punching Trish in the face. Yeah, Barbie's looking the best health-wise, obviously, because she just she came in last. Hi, Mac. Thank you for the 20. Uh, I know all about Ocho. I have it downloaded already. I want to check it out at some point. All right, Ada, I don't know what that was, but it was a good try. Also, shout out to that counter when they bonked heads. All 
All right, Trish was number 27, so Trish is odd. Ada was 23, she's also odd. Lita is 29 at odd, so Barbie is the only even number left. So even your bets are all in on Barbie. A lot of odds left. Oh, is Ada gonna get eliminated finally by Trish Stratus? Oh, Ada! No, Ada is still in. Oh, uh oh, Ada's stunned. Ada's stunned, that's not good. Yo, Barbie's pants are so tight. You see them cheeks? Oh, big clothesline from Lita on a Trish. Gavin the Impulse, thank you for the 28. Lita, twist, twist of fate! Classic. Classic. Oh, Ada looked like she was trying to escape. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, clunk. Bonking heads. Uh, what's Ada doing? Oh, that was fucking cool. She's still in the ring, though, but that was sick. That was incredibly scuffed, but it connected. Counter by Trish. Oh. Barbie's by the ropes. That's not good for the... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It might be... Oh, good reversal from Barbie. Good reversal from Ada. Oh, is Lita about to get eliminated? Lita? She's so close. Ada is not helping. Lita is still in. Ada getting some health back. Barbie just sniffing Lita's feet. Lita's still in. Yeah, this is the final four. This is the final four. Haven't been any eliminations in a while. All of them are damaged in the health and body department. Oh, Trish is taunting. She's going to do something crazy. I'm ready. Let's see it, Trish. Oh, a chop across the titties. Uh-oh. Ada's got Lita again. Is this it? Oh, Barbie might go over. Oh, wait. Lita's been eliminated. Okay. That's another odd down. Oh, big reversal. Oh, and right into Trish's knee. Oh, break up from Barbie there. Oh, Ada. Dup. Ada. Dup. Oh, Barbie's been eliminated. It was a reversal from Ada. The evens have lost. It's now Ada against Trish. Ada was... Where was Ada? I can't find it where I fucking wrote her down. Ada was 23 and Trish was 27. All right. So you can pay it out. Team Odd is going to win. Now is it going to be... Well, which mommy is it going to be? Asian mommy or Canadian mommy? Oh, here we go. Oh, Ada. Ada's looking good health-wise. Is this going to be it? Shout out to that guy saying use the door. <laughs> His shirt anyway. Big reversal from Trish. Oh. Oh, that might... Ooh, that was a fucking swift kick to the face. Oh, this might be it, gamers. This might be it. This might be it. Ada is still stunned. This might be it. Oh, the, the, wait. Hold on. Oh, she's trying to kick her out. Trish Stratus is the winner. She wins. Hell yeah. Canada wins. Way to go. Wait, main event title shot. I'm just going to give him the belt, Michael Cole. God damn. That was a good one.
surviving against all these other superstars and standing tall here and now. God damn. Yeah, dude. What a good one. She's pointing at nothing. I've, you know, she's, she's high right now. The adrenaline. Uh, I forgot where that is. Is it? Oh, title management. Here we go. Uh, I'll give her the diva, the diva belt. I like that belt. Oh, wait, no, it'd be all. We got to go to Trish. There you go. Oh, I got to save, of course. There we go. All right, let's set up the uh, let's set up the next match here. Let's see what we're gonna do here, dude. Ada lasted a long ass time. You know what? Let me just set up another one, but this time we'll do the uh, we'll do the guys, we'll do the fellas. This is the best way to show off all the wrestlers, and this gets real hype. So, and I love these I love these stupid ass rumbles. All right, so let me set this up again. Give me give me a little bit of time. Let me put on the Europop again, chat. YouTube, I'm going to pause the recording, and I'll be back in like like three minutes. Be right back. All right, YouTube. I think we're all set for this next rumble. We have Bob as the lead man from last time. So this is all... Um, this is all created wrestlers, but some of the created wrestlers are wrestlers that weren't in the game originally. Uh, of the 30, I believe 25 of these are new ones. Um, so I think we're good to go. 53% even and one or 47% odd. Why is it? Why did even go first? Why is even one and odd? Glasses are fired. All right, here we go. Here we go. We Scotty Too Hotty versus Springtrap. <laughs> Here we go. Oh shit, I need to keep track of who's who's where. What a sentence. We have Scotty Too Hotty. Here we go. Springtrap is doing unholy things to Scotty Too Hotty. All right, who's coming in next? This is Halloween Havoc, by the way. Next up is Chucky. Is it Chucky the Killer or Chucky Finster? Who's to say? It's me. It's Chucky the Killer Doll, who is significantly taller, but disregard that. I'm glad Sky Too Hotty lasted longer than Pokemane in the ring. All right. God, Springtrap is so... They did a good job on that skin. Very menacing. All right. And the 30-second interval is, is stayed again. Good. Next up, number four, Ichiban. We got to have Ichiban back in. Getting ready for infinite wealth coming soon. He's in. All right, Sky Tuhati has awoken from his slumber, going right after Springtrap. Ichiban going after a literal child. Granted, he's a killer, but I don't think Ichiban really cares at this point. Everything's an RPG in his head. He doesn't know where he is. Big kick to Springtrap's face by Ichiban Kasuga. M. Bison. Going to psycho crush roll over the ring. Chucky in the corner. Uh-oh. Springtrap has Ichiban on the ropes. Will Ichiban be the first eliminated? Uh-oh. Ichiban? No one's going to save him. Is Ichiban still in? Ichiban's okay for now? Oh, my God. M. Bison just chokeslammed a doll. Oh, dude. M. Bison taunting. Thank you for that story to whoever that was. Oh, Chucky going for the choke slam on M. Bison. All right, next up, Grandmaster Sexay. Rest in peace. Almost all of Too Cool in the ring. This is like the beginning of Royal Rumble... What was it, 2000? When it was those two guys and Rikishi were the first three, I think? 
Shout out to Too Cool. Grandmaster Sexy already on the ropes by Chucky. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Grandmaster Sexy, you just got here. Nope, stay in. Sky Too Hotty with nice slam on Springtrap there. Grandmaster Sexy still in. Who's coming to get number seven? Mr. Popo. Things are gonna get kind of insensitive, but I guess we've all accepted that this character's okay, even though he kind of looks weird. Mr. Popo is in. Uh-oh. We almost have a full ring off the rip. Okay, Mr. Popo and Sky Too Hotty bonked heads. Oh, wait, make sure I gotta keep track with who's who's being entered. Oh, Chucky's been eliminated by Scotty Too Hotty. Our first victim, number eight, is none other than Clank of Ratchet and Clank fame. There he is. He's a little bit taller, but ignore that. Oh, someone got busted open, I think. Ichiban trying to eliminate M. Bison, but he's still in the ring. Ooh, good reversal by Clank there. Sky Too Hotty and Springtrap still in this. I mean, we're still early on, but still. Does Clank have a halo? Yeah, yeah, he died in the latest game. Horrible accident. So they're just signifying that. Betrayal, Sky Too Hotty beating up Grandmaster Sexay. But the Brotherhood. And Bison on the ground. Ichiban eliminating Springtrap. FNAF has been canceled. Springtrap has been eliminated by Ichiban Kazuga. Everyone under 14 years old is officially crying. Oh, here we go. Sky Too Hot, he's been eliminated. Doesn't matter. The man, the myth, the legend, Ninja, has entered the ring. All the women in the audience, I'm so sorry. You have to vacate the building. Ninja is here. And he might get eliminated immediately from M. Bison. And Clank, okay. Uh, Ninja is, oh, Grandmaster Sexy is over there as well. Ninja is on the, well, he's not out yet. Oh my God, Ninja. Ninja, oh, good reversal. Ninja staying in, okay. God damn. All those Fortnite skills. Uh-oh, Ichiban, Ichiban eliminating Ninja immediately. Based. Oh, Mr. Popo has been eliminated as well. Back to back. Losing people. Ah, I'm sorry, Ninja. I'm sorry, man. Ichiban's kicking ass. He's got a lot of eliminations, I feel like. All right, who's coming in next? Oh, M. Bison and Ichiban working together. Here comes Colossus. The metal man himself. There he is. God, he's ginormous. If you remember, I think when we did this last time, he was unstoppable. It might have something to do with him being made of metal, but who's to say? Hey, Clank's made of metal, so... We'll see what happens. Ooh, okay, face plant. Next up, Miles Morales coming in. The Sunflower himself. There he is. He's got the he's got the headphones on. How will he do? He's got the exaggerated swagger of a black team. That is unstoppable. Oh, Clank doesn't give a fuck though. It's the swagger. Oh, Colossus. Oh, no, Colossus. What do you do with Ichi? Colossus. Okay, I thought he was going to throw him out of the ring. Next up is the Godfather, one of my favorite wrestlers from the Attitude Era. Where are the hoes? Godfather's entering the ring without the hoes. He... No, that's his power. Shout out to the Godfather. You guys remember when he turned into the Good Father? When he was part of, what was it, Right to Censor? <laughs> Shout out to the, the Good Father and the Godfather. <laughs> Dude, the Attitude Era was so good. Was 
Next up, oh, it's Waka. Oh, are there any Al beds in the ring? Any Al beds in the ring? You're gonna get targeted. Here comes Waka. The most racist character in Final Fantasy. Well, I've only played one Final Fantasy. The most racist character in the one Final Fantasy game I've played. I throw a ball, yeah. I hate you because of your race, yeah. We got ourselves a full ring. Make Spira great again? Oh, kind of. Uh, Waka, why are you going after the black guy? Waka, what the, f the fuck are you doing? W Waka. Waka, please hit a white guy. Thank you. Okay, we're fine. The bot can be uploaded. Uh oh, and Bison, no! M. Bison choke slamming Ichiban out of the ring. Oh, and then kicking Clank right in the chest. I think there is two more real rep, real wrestlers that are creator wrestlers. I have. Yeah, Infinite Wealth has been canceled. Oh, that reminds me. I should tell Tina we should make another uh, uh, Rayquaza charm. But have it be Ichiban on one side, and then on the other side, Old Man Kiryu. Like we have the Kiryu and Majima one. I'll talk to her about that. And then we need, we need to talk to Bilby, because I believe Bilby made the first one. Godfather's health is, like, full. I guess he was taking a nap for a while. Oh, big kick by Miles Morales on the Waka. Using that Spider-Man strength. Oh, big spear by M. Bison. M. Bison kind of, kind of showing no mercy. God damn. M. Bison was the fifth entrant. He's the longest lasting person here. Uh-oh. No, the Godfather's been eliminated. I told you he didn't have the hose. He didn't have the hose. I have no idea what happened to Colossus there. Next up is Finn. Finn the human. Finn is in. Oh, the, we're in an earthquake. The girthquake is happening right now. All right, we have the two metal bros going at it. you think they'd work together. Big store at FrameRateMerch.com. Thank you so much. Almost a full ring again. Finn going right after Colossus. Holy shit, no fear. Can't wait till I lose my voice, by the way. I'm surprised it's lasted so long, at this long. Ooh, all right. Grandmaster Sexy just raw chopping Clank's chest. DDT by Finn there. And Bison is taunting somebody. I don't know who. Oh, Miles Morales might have just got saved by M. Bison and Waka, ironically. Full ring, who's coming in next? Toon Link! Here comes Toon Link. Little Wind Waker love. Okay, M. Bison kicking a child in the face. Fucking Miles Morales saved again by Waka. M. Bison finally eliminated from Colossus. And Bison was doing a crazy good job. Okay. The two link just got split in half. All right, I think Grandmaster Sexe is now the longest, or, or the person who's been in here the longest. Toon Link came in and he's already dead. <laughs> he's just in, the, he's just dead. Walker Redemption arc? Oh my God. Uh-oh. Oh no! Colossus has been eliminated by Clank! What a hurricanrana. Oh, Miles Morales? Miles is still in, might get eliminated by Grandmaster Sexy. Let's see. By the way, we're halfway through the Rumble chat. This Rumble. Ooh, Miles is still in. Toon Link doing something there after finally waking up. Oh, and he's got slammed on his stupid elf head. Clank is on the ropes. Clank has made it back in. 
Next up is Noob Saibot. Some Mortal Kombat love. Clank! Look at Clank! Saluting our troops for some reason. Thanks, Clank. You're in the middle of a match. Oh my god, Miles slamming Toon Link's knees into the canvas. Noob Saibot missed big time. All right, full ring, pause champ. Full ring, pausers. Next up is Kane. This is retro Kane, so this is his old look. The one I love the most. There's retro Kane. Oh, Waka's been, oh no, sorry. Clank has been eliminated. Waka is almost eliminated. This is the Kane I remember, the big red machine. Miles has been eliminated. Grandmaster Sexy's been eliminated. What is happening right now? We just lost three people immediately. Holy fuck. Oh God. New, please, he's a child. We had a full ring for four seconds. There goes Grandmaster Sexy and Miles Morales doing the walk of shame. Waka back on the ropes. Oh, Kane was about to taunt. Oh, Jesus. Booty bounce Toon Link there. <laughs> Look at Finn's face. Oh, just slamming him. Kane's outfit back then was so good. It really was. This is like the best outfit, the best mask. His like reveal was also like the craziest. Maven! So, winner of Tough Enough Season 1. Didn't do much in the WWE, but I included Maven because I just discovered his YouTube channel recently. Also, Finn is gone. Maven has a YouTube channel that he just started, and it's super interesting. So I want to throw Maven in this. I also discovered last night that Stevie Richards, also, or is it Stevie or Steven Richards? I forget. I think it's Stevie Richards. Has a YouTube channel that's also very good. So I'm consuming wrestling content. Stevie Richards, okay. And I, I like marathoned all of Maven's videos. And I'm going to start watching Stevie Richards' videos. They're very good. Here comes King. King of Tekken fame. Or if you're Michelle Rodriguez, Tekken. King is in. Can't believe Waka is still in. But yeah, if you're looking for... Wrestling. Oh my god. King just went to the air. Uh, if you're looking for good wrestling content, definitely recommend Maven's channel and Stevie Richards on top of some other ones, but they're former wrestlers, so I think it makes it more interesting. Here comes Dave. Oh, Dave, who you may ask? Oh, you'll see. You'll see. It's Dave the Diver! Dave the Diver is in! He's taking a break from diving and helping with the restaurant to enter the Royal Rumble. Dave is in. One of the best games of the year. He's lost weight. He got into shape for the Royal Rumble. Still wearing the flippers, though. I respect it. Noob Saibot on the ropes. Maven trying to eliminate Kane, which would be crazy. Next up is the Green Ranger. Rest in peace to Tommy. Uh-oh, I can feel my voice going. If things are going not great for the Green Ranger, he does have the flute handy. He will be able to summon his Zord. Almost a full ring. Last time this happened, we lost half the contestants in like a second. Oh, wow, that was cool. Uh-oh. Dave, the diver's about to get choked up by Kane! Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime is entering the ring. For better or for worse. There he is. I just realized I think I missed Mr. Popo getting eliminated. I fucking... So much is happening. Fuck, Mr. Mime looks like a nightmare fuel. Oh, 
Yeah, Mr. Popo, we lost him like 20 minutes ago. I just missed him. Do the Mr. Mime dance? I literally just did the Mr. Mime dance. What do you mean? Maven is gone. Sorry, Maven. Listen, I just added you for the, the YouTube shout out, but it was nice to have you in. All right, people staying in for a little bit longer now. King taking a nap over there. The Green Ranger is about to get tombstoned by Kane. Never mind. Dave is beating the shit out of Waka, and Noob Saibot was beating up Mr. Mime. All right, we're up to there. Are, we're on number 23, so less than 10 contestants left. Whoever wins this will have a match with none other than Goku Black. Who has that title, dude? Uh-oh. Dave might get eliminated from Kane. How is Waka still in? Uh-oh. Fucking Mr. Mime's face as he gets carried by Noob Saibot. All right, who's coming in to take the final spot right now? All right, I, I still don't know what special that is, but King went into the air again. Next up, oh shit, it's Santa Claus. Here comes Santa. You better watch out. 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 Immediately, Mr. Mime goes after Santa Claus. Mr. Mime, known Jewish Pokemon, not a fan of Christmas, taking it very personally. Davis spinning. Spin to win. Oh my God. <laughs> Look at him, bench. Look at him, bench. The Green Ranger. Dave and Santa Claus working together to beat up Kane. That's a sense that's never been said to this moment. Okay. Every time I look at King, he's on the ground. Uh oh, Dave going after Waka. We got Santa Claus going against Noob Saibot. Mr. Mime gonna reverse. The Green Ranger, he does. Oh, look at Noob Saibot. Doing the mix-up. All right, what are we doing? Waka didn't know where to go with Kane there. Oh, Mr. Mime slam. Once again, King is out. Cold in the middle of the ring. Uh-oh, it might be Waka's time. It might be Waka's time. Dave and Mr. Mime working together. Noob Saibot on the ropes. Waka is finally eliminated. I hate all bad. Yeah. Noob is back in. Racism has been defeated. You're welcome. Santa Claus holding up Mr. Mime for so long. Good Lord. Good Lord. He's stunting on him. He's stunting on him. Merry Christmas, bitch. Our Green Ranger, are they going to eliminate Santa Claus? Uh-oh. Noob Saibot about to go over the ring. No, he's just getting choke slammed. Okay. Everyone's still in. Besides Waka. Dave just walking around. Wondering how the sushi restaurant's doing. Hopefully Boncho's okay. Oh, Santa's on the ropes. Oh, Santa's good. Santa's good. No follow-up there. I don't know why King is taunting. He is just... I forgot he was there, even though he's got the furry face on. Or the furry mask. I can't even see what's happening. I think there's a power bomb. There we go. Oh, big spear by the Green Ranger on Mr. Mind, but he got right the fuck up. Okay. All right. Who's coming in next? Oh, uh, we have Markiplier. Oh my god, Green Ranger's been eliminated. Can I get some E's in chat? E. Thank god this wasn't Darkiplier. I'd shit my pants in fear. Markiplier is in. He's going right after King. Oh, big clothesline on Kane by Santa Claus. 
Mark going after Dave the Diver. All right, King. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but it looks like you were trying to booty blast someone. Yeah, he like tripped. He tripped off the ropes. Markiplier? Oh, it looked like he was going to eliminate Kane, but King bailed him out. Oh, dropped him right in his head. Oh, uh, noob sidebots on the ropes. Is Mr. Mime going to get an elimination? Oh, Dave the Diver's about to get choke slammed. King helping on that as well. Uh, is Noob going to get eliminated from King and Mr. Mime? He is! God damn! Oh, here comes Grimace. Here comes Grimace, the big purple testicle. He's going to make sure you drink his shake. Oh my god, I never saw his back. It says the Grimace shake. <laughs> I never saw that. I never noticed that when I downloaded his wrestler. It just says Grimace shake on the back. He's doing an ad. Oh my god, he's picking up Dave. Oh my god. Did he do suck it? Oh, I missed him when I was laughing. Oh, going right after King. Just punch him right in the chin. Oh, Dave! Oh, Dave's been eliminated by Santa Claus. Oh, Mr. Mime. Oh, I thought he was going to eliminate Santa Claus right there. Once again, still don't know how King is in this fucking match. Grimace is already stunned. Naughty list for Dave. Mr. Mime's on the ropes. Eliminated by Kane. Oh, here comes Hunk. More Resident Evil representation. Hunk is in. Uh-oh. King going for the elimination on Kane. Oh, Hunk coming to help out. Is this the end of Kane? Parentheses retro. No, he's still in. He is still in. Grimace is about to slam Markiplier down. What a sentence. I'm keeping my eye on Grimace just in case he does the, uh, he does the suck it again. Nice, Hunk. That was good. You nailed that. Huge move there. Did Grimace just do a backflip with Markiplier? What the fuck was that? Yeah, Kane! All right, who's coming in next? Number, this is number 27, I believe. Oh, this is the spot of Spider-Verse fa uh, fame. Here we go. Immediately powerbombed and stunned by Santa. <laughs> Is it King's time to go finally? No! King is still in! Good God. Oh my, dude. Grimace is so agile. All right, well, the spot is stunned again. Oh, what is fucking Grimace doing? Oh, kicked in the back of that. Here comes Charizard. He looks so good. It's Charizard. <laughs> I'll be honest, I downloaded him because he has got the horse head on. That's Charizard, everybody. There he is. Guys, look, he's got the tail and everything. It's Charizard. F Charizard, flamethrower. All right, we got ourselves a full ring, but Kane might get eliminated by this doofy-ass Charizard. Hold on. Is it Kane's time to go? Uh oh, Santa taking Grimace to Suplex City. Kane is still in. All right, we have two more people left after this. Oh, Grimace looks like he's trying to eliminate Santa over there. Oh my God, Crane just threw Charizard like he weighs nothing. All right, Santa Claus still in for now. Oh, nope, Santa still in.
He just wants to make his opponents no way. Astounding power. Oh, gee, Char uh, Charizard, goddamn. You look stupid. You're not doing great. He's getting pushed out of the defensive. Hang in there. Just a little bit longer to go. Who's looking the best right now? Markiplier, health wise. He's the only one with like a lot of green on his health bar. King is King was number 19. I think King is the earliest one here right now. By the way, Charizard's alternate costume is the same look, but he's uh, in black like his shiny, which I thought was a good touch. You can't make someone tap in the Royal Rumble, Mark. They got to go over the ropes. All right, no one's... Oh, hold on. Oh, I thought Charizard's going to throw him... Okay, throw him over. He's not. Santa Claus was T-posing in the corner there. I mean, we all know Christmas is Jesus' birthday, so... A little shout-out to the big man, JC, up in the sky. Charizard's been eliminated by Mark! The spot is going to chokeslam Kane! Is that legal? Can he do that? Oh my god, Grimace just kicked Markiplier right in the fucking face. That is rude as hell, I agree. Alright, the w reminder, the winner of this match has a one-on-one -on -one match with Goku Black for the title. It might be a quick one, because you never know what the AI. Uh-oh. King and Kane might eliminate the spot here. The spot has been eliminated. Ah. Oh. King and Kane, the K and K connection. Thank God there's only two of them, not three. Would have to end the stream. Number 29. Coming on in. Dude, villain of the week. Oh, here comes Bob. Kawami Bob, here he comes. Can I get some Ranger Clowns in the chat? It's clown time. Bob, what are you doing? You look lost. Santa's been eliminated by Hunk. All right. The reason we're doing a one-on-one -on -one match, by the way, for the for the belt, is there. That's the only chance for interference. And maybe we'll have a Money in the Bank redemption. There's no way to guarantee it, but the only way to do it is in normal one-on-one -on -one matches, unfortunately. But that does mean the match could be over in like 10 seconds. But Goku Black is a villain, dude. He defended it so many times. All right, last entrant in the Rumble. Last but not least is, of course, who else but the Giga Chad. He's in. Grimish is through. King across the ring. The Giga Chad is here at number 30. A good position. Immediately uh, countered by Hunk there. Oh my god, Hunk. Not afraid of the Giga Chad. Uh oh. Who is Kane going to choke slam? Nobody. Hunk saved somebody. Markiplier is just flying through the air right now. How many odds do we have left? Uh, I'll tell you who's... Oh. Oh, he just kicked him right in the nuts. Okay, so... Giga Chad is 30. Kiwami Bob is 29. Uh, Hunk. Hunk is 26. Grimace is 25. Uh, King is 19. It's a good mix. Kane is 17. And I think that's everybody. So it's a good mix. Pretty even split. We'll, we'll check again when there's less wrestlers in. Kwame Bob, is it your time to go? Is it King's time to go finally? What's Markiplier going to do? Let's see. All right, Mark. Elbow drop right into Kane. Kane is actually stunned. A good time to try and eliminate him. Or just fucking leave him there. He just dropped. Oh, my God. He dropped Grimace right in his big, stupid head. I don't know what that move was from Mark. Dude, Mark is feeling himself right now. He's on a tear. Mark is going wild right now. 
Uh-oh. Mark and the Giga Chad working together on Kwame Bob. Bullshit. Kwame Bob's a good guy. He lets you exchange your points for unlockables. All right, King. I don't know what that was. All right, King. King, you're living on borrowed time right now. Number 19 in the Rumble, still in. Might get eliminated by Kane right now. Hunk lifting the Giga Chat again. Oh my God. Yeah, it's, it's surprising that Kane is also in. That's true. Kane is number 17. 17 right here. Uh oh. Markiplier, is this the end of Markiplier? Good reversal by Mark. Oh my God. Grimace was trying to take him out. He went Darkiplier there for a second. Oh my God. Grimace. Just throwing Hunk around like he's nothing. Uh oh. Is it time? Is it Grimace's time? Kane? I think Kane's gonna eliminate Grimace. Here we go. By the Grimace shake. No! Grimace is gone! Rip Grimace. You did a good job, Grimace. You did a good job. Number 25 hung on for a while. Uh oh. Is Mark gonna eliminate the Giga Chad? Is Mark gonna eliminate the Giga Chad? He is! Oh my god, the Giga Chad at number 30 eliminated so quickly! God damn! We have five people left. Stunner by Markiplier on Kane. Oh my. Dude, what the fuck? What happened to Markiplier? He's beasting right now. Giga Chad, not a great performance, unfortunately. King and Markiplier with the choke slam on Bob. Uh oh. Ooh, good reversal by King. Markiplier was thinking about it. He was definitely thinking about it. Oh! Oh, that's the end of Markiplier. Eliminated by Hunk. What a good... What a good showing from Mark. What a good showing from Mark there. God damn. Jeez. All right, we'll go over who's left in their number. Kane is 17. King is 19. Bob is 29. And uh, Hunk is 26. Hunk is the last even. Uh, and when it, once again, evens. Kind of fucked here. Deja vu with the predictions. Ooh. God, both of their backs just got broken. These guys are all kind of hurt. Bob technically has the most amount of health, but like, he's in all red right now. Uh-oh. Is that the end of Hunk? This might be the end for Evens. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, there he's got Evens are, are, are eliminated again. Kane and King are still in this. Oh my God. He picked his ass back up. I think Bob had a title shot last time against Goku Black. Uh-oh, is this the end of Kane? Is this the end of Kane? This might be it. Oh, what the fuck is Bob doing? He broke it up. Bob! Bob, just chill out and get your health back. That would have been it. That would have been a huge elimination. Oh, big spear by Bob. Well, now's a good time to eliminate King. He's stunned. Or just continue to beat the shit out of him for no reason. <laughs> Okay, Bob. You haven't won yet. Yeah, you hurt your knee. Did you hurt your knee there? All 
All right, King taking this time to rest up. Kane getting his energy back. Uh-oh. Bob, if you get eliminated here, this is your fault. Kane should be gone right now. Kane should be gone. The bassoon of death. Bob, it doesn't bode well. Ideas, man. Thank you for the four years. Oh, Bob still in. Okay, King went for the spear, but whiffed. There it is. He got it that time. He got it that time. All right, Kane is going to take a breather. Bob, he's on the rope. He was on the ropes, kind of. Going after the big man, Kane. Bob can't make up his mind who he wants to eliminate. What the fuck has King done the whole match? Survive. He has survived. What? What the fuck happened? <laughs> what happened there? Uh-oh. Is this it finally? Is Bob finally going to do it? King has been eliminated! It is Bob against Kane. Kane should not be here right now. Is Bob going to do it? Oh, this might be Bob! We might get a rematch! Oh, Bob! Is he going to do it? He is not. No. Bob isn't strong enough. Uh-oh. Bob, your hubris might come back to bite you here. Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> oh, that might be it for Bob. Oh, that might be it for Bob. Oh, but he's still not trying to eliminate him for some reason. Kane is playing with his food right now. Bob has no health. His health is the Shadow Realm, and his body is all red. I guess so is Kane's, but... Oh, big reversal from Bob. Another big reversal from Bob. Oh, a spear! Okay, now Kane is stunned! Is Bob gonna do it? Oh, he's set up for it! Bob wins! He did it again! Here is your winner, Oh my god, Bob! I can't believe Kane lasted that long, too. He's number 17. We just witnessed quite the combination of endurance in ring. What a what a match. Back to back great rumbles. That's great. We're looking at the back of his head. Wonderful. Wonderful. Nice shirt. Oh, thanks, man. Is Bob a face or a heel? I have no idea. I guess maybe it depends who you ask. Oh, I should probably show this too. I haven't showed this yet, but I did get a new uh I got a new skin for Money in the Bank. Uh, it's a box of Eggo waffles. <laughs> I, just, I, know, I just thought it was funny, so I uh, I gave it to him. Oh, I need to change uh, who has that, but I just downloaded that, and I meant to assign it, but I didn't. Uh, so Squirtle, by the way, still has the Money in the Bank for the Poggers Championship, which is what uh, Bob will be fighting for right now. Yo, Zell, thank you for the gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. That's very, very nice of you. So many gifted subs. 25! All right, so we'll do one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, one-on-one -on -one normal match, I think, is the only way to potentially get interference. So we'll just do a random-ass SummerSlam here. Okay, confirm. Since this is a one-on-one, -on -one, we'll put the entrance on. This is a title match. Match options. Um... Entrance on, select arena, custom match rules. Oh, I could do two out of three falls to make it more interesting, make it a little bit longer. That might be the move. Yeah, we'll do. We'll try that. Um, yeah, we want potential run-ins for sure. No limit. Uh, let's see. We'll take DQ off. Uh, okay. 
That's fine. I think I did that all correct. Select referee. Yo, give me the uh give me the NXT ref. Why not? Get, throw him in there. I can't wait for there to be no interference at all. All right, so first we need Bob. There he goes. Uh, oh, well, should we add a manager? No, no, no manager. No manager this time. And then this has to be, of course, um, Goku Black. We'll give him a tire two. Championship. The Poggers Championship's on the line. Prediction is up. Who is going to win? Bob or Goku Black? Let's see. Give him Kane out of respect. No, if, if I was going to give anyone to Bob, it would probably be Ichiban. Hopefully these uh, intros, by the way, don't have copyrighted music. We'll see. Actually, everything's muted. Will it even play? I didn't even think about this. Oh, no, that's right. It's going to be silent because I turned all the music off so I can upload this. That's all right. You can still see him walk out. You can still see him walk out. We can see him come out, yeah. It's Bob! It didn't show the prediction for you? Uh, we, can, we can redo it. Because you guys got some time. Hold on. It's a big time opportunity Hold on. the title will be on the line here. You're right you guys right. will get your points back. From the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a All right, let me start this prediction here. Here tonight. Some have called the challenger an underdog tonight, but he is Who will win? Kwame Bob or Goku Black? Whoops. Goku Black. You guys got a minute. There you go. All right, so this is a two out of three falls, no disqualification, one-on-one -on -one match for the Pogger Championship, dude. We are about to see something good. Oh, what a fucking, what a, what, oh, everyone's booing him, holy shit. Everyone hates Goku Black, what the fuck? Yeah, once again, I'm sorry there's no no music. I have it turned off so we can upload this to YouTube. And there's the, <laughs> there's the fucking Poggers face. The Pog champ himself, Goku Black. There you go. Right. My heart says Bob, but my wallet says Goku. That's fair. That's fair. And the booze, this is even funnier because there's no music, so you can clearly hear the booze. Coming up, and a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE. I mean, dude, he's defended this belt like so many times. Well, I think it was like twice, but here we go. Oh, there's Bob. Bob's like, I'm... Oh, Bob's doing the fuck train there. You see that? No breaks. Raven, see you later. Uh, Plaid Warren, lesbian symptom, midnight. Uh, thank you so much, Zell. Idea Sarah. I'm probably gonna miss a lot of subs during this, but uh, thank you guys very much. Thank you. The fucking Pog Champ every or the Poggers every time. <laughs> All right, chat. Here we go. I forgot a lot of these intros are kind of long. What do you think the longest intro is? Do you think like Undertaker? Because he took forever to... <laughs> that fucking caught me off guard. Uh, do you think the Undertaker is the longest? Oh my god. I don't really keep up with modern day wrestling, but I know Undertaker took a lot of fucking time to walk to the ring. All right, here we go, gamers. Here we go. I love that they show the belt in these, like, little cutscenes. Just, just seeing the fucking Poggers face is so good. 
Now Roman does. All right, here we go. You got to hand over the Poggers belt, man. You're going to lift it up to show everyone? This is what you're fighting for. You want to be Poggers, Bob. You want to be Poggers. Here we go. <laughs> Poggers. All right, gamers. Here we go. And we're off. I hope we do get some interference, but obviously it's completely random. Undertaker would intentionally make his intro longer if he thought the match was going to be bad. Yeah, I remember hearing him say that like a podcast interview or something. So this is the second time these two are fighting, if I remember correctly. Goku Black has been pretty dominant in his title defense, but this is a two out of three. Does Bob know the Tiger drop? I don't think so. Bob off to a good start, though. To a great start. Can that be the month's highlight thumbnail? That's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea. If someone clipped that, that could be a good uh, that could be a good thumbnail for the month. Look at this. Oh, this is just too far. Well, Goku is back on his bullshit right now. Bob started off so well. Do you guys think Austin Theory is going to interfere in this match as well? All right, Bob on the offense right now. Bob looking good. Nice. Oh, Bob feeling himself right now. It's looking good for Bob fans. It's looking good. All right. Oh, Bob! With the flip! I think if I do this again, I might take off. Uh, I should probably take off uh, count out. That was my fault. I should take it. Hopefully, it doesn't play a major role, but I definitely should have taken that off. Ooh, right in the spine. Goku Black in momentum again. Okay. See ya. Oh, Goku Black is going for a weapon. He's got a chair. And Bob doesn't give a shit. Bob does not give a fuck. Oh, good reversal from Goku Black. Oh, punch him in the gut. That's mean. Oh, with the kick. Oh, he stopped on his foot. Yo, hey. Like an Abbott and Costello routine. Uh -oh. oh, run the leg. Come on, Bob. Come on, Bob. You're doing so well. You got a weapon right there. The, gr the great equalizer. Oh. All right, Bob outside the ring right now. Okay, Goku picked it up and put it back down. Nice of Goku to give Bob a second to... Uh-oh. Oh, right in the fucking head. Oh, that is not good for Bob. Oh, another one. Oh. oh, okay. Good dodge by Bob. There you go. You you fucking wish, Bob. Okay. That was barely a one. Oh, Bob's feeling himself again. All right. Oh, big punch to Goku's face. Bob back on the offensive. Bob, there is a chair. Ooh, to the back of the head. Bob, there is a chair right there. Oh, reversal from Goku Black. Oh. Is that a Kamehameha? He is stunned right now. Uh-oh, this could be one count. Bob kicks out. Bob kicks out. Okay. Bob's health is pretty low, but there is more damage on Goku Black's body. He's going for it again. Ooh, that wasn't even a one count. Bob is back, baby. He's back. All right, where's Goku Black going? Getting another weapon? I guess the chair wasn't enough. He's... Okay, I guess that chair's better. All right, well, now there's two chairs. Oh, kick to the back of the head. Off the ropes. Goku doesn't want to be in the ring. What are we going to do here? Oh, Bob's going out. Bob's going out. Okay, Goku just stood there and took the chair. That was an interesting strategy from Goku there. He just stood there and... Oh, now he's just taking shots. Oh, he's just taking shots right now. Oh, my God. Goku Black is getting destroyed. 
Goku is choking right now. All right, throws him back in the ring. Goku is not looking good. He took like four unnecessary chair shots. Bob going up high. Oh, the elbow drop right into the spine of Goku Black. Goku is learning what Kawami means. Oh, a reversal. Goku needs to get some weapon shots in to even this out. Elbow to the face. Oh, he's taunting. Bob can get the chair right now and just hit you over the head. Or just slap you in the face. Oh, Bob. Oh, that might be one. That might be one pinfall right there. Let's see. All right, that's one. You need two. It's not over yet, but Bob has taken the lead. Goku fucking around too much. Oh, boy. Oh, it might be over. Oh, it might be over. Is this it for the Poggers Championship? Bob wins! Oh, my God. Bob is the winner. No interference, of course. Why would there be? Bob finally doing it. Holy shit, Goku Black just didn't know what to do. It was too much. Way to go, Bob. The new winner. He's done the unthinkable. Way to go, Bob. Way to go. Good shit. All right, let's do a... What can we do here? Well, I kind of want to do a war games. Maybe we'll take we'll do war games in a little bit. I figure we could do the war games and whoever wins, whatever team wins that war game, we could do like a fatal four way for because I think I have another belt that doesn't have a uh a person that has it. Nope. It's uh Oh yeah. Oh, we have the oh, I have tag belts as well. Oh, I forgot. There's also the Pikachu championship that Tomato Man has. Forgot about that. How can I forget? <laughs> Liv Moss, dude. Liv Moss. Dude, the king of Fortnite. You know what? Let's have him defend it right now. Why not? He's had it too good for too long. Let's give it a... Uh... Oh, I guess we could do like a tournament or something for it. Mm. Maybe we'll just do a fatal four-way. Why not? No, no, no. We'll do a Fatal 4-Way for the War Games thing. Let's do... Let's do a Triple Threat. Triple Threat. Uh... Hmm. We could do Triple Threat Table, but you have to go through two tables. But we could also do Ladder. Ladder could be interesting. And we'll do Ladder. I like I like the Ladder matches. They're, they're stupid. They're real dumb. They're real dumb. All right, so make sure I do this. Oh, let me check the... This is a title match, obviously. Custom match rules. Is there really anything? Time limit? No, I mean, there's really not much you can do here. Okay. Special referee. Let's get old school referee. Why not? The Biden backflip. That was for a... That was for the money in the bank, I think. All right, so obviously we need Tomato Man. We need Tomato Man in. He is the champion. Okay. Uh, I kind of want to give... Let's give Kane another chance. Because he did crazy things in that rumble. And then we let's let's pick somebody random here. Let's see. Um, we have Aku, All-Star Zombie. We have Charlie, Chucky, Clank. I'm trying to see who we haven't used. Oh, this is <laughs> this is Dave's portrait, by the way. Oh, I don't know why Fox's thing is so tiny, by the way. He looks so little. Ghostface, Gig Chad, The Godfather. No, Goku Black, fuck you. Uh, there's Grimace, Hunk. Who can we grab here? We could grab Joe Biden. He is a good performer when there's a ladder around. Uh, yeah, I might go I might go Joe. Uh, Onomichio. Oh, I guess Quan Chi's broken. Rip. There's Sam... <laughs> 
Spanish Santa, the Shadow Heartless Shaggy, uh, Snoop Dio Double G. Yeah, we'll go. Uh, we'll go, Joe. If we're lucky, we'll get a classic Joe backflip. All right, for the Pikachu Championship. Oh wait, should I do in? Uh, yeah, I'll do another entrance. Why not? They're they're they they take a little while, but they're pretty dumb. I like them. All right, I uh, the prediction is up. Look at this fucking picture. As per usual, just look at this stupid picture. This is some of my favorite things from these streams. Is just the promo pictures. <laughs> What a crazy cast of characters. Kane, Joe Biden, and the tomato guy from Fortnite for the Pikachu Championship. Also, there's a ladder involved. Let's see how it goes. Oh, that's true. Two, two politicians. Dude, I just made this game political. I'm so sorry. All right, there's a ladder. Oh, we're in Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, it went away. Oh, the American Nightmare. Cody Rhodes? I hope this is like Joe Biden. Is this Tomato Man? Is Tomato Man the American Nightmare? The oh, it's, <laughs> it's fucking Joe Biden! Oh my god! <laughs> Yo, Joe's so excited! I'm fucking crying! <laughs> Oh, Joe's so excited to be there. Oh, my God. Dark Brandon is in the ring. Oh, holy fuck. I did not see this coming. Oh, I'm so happy we're doing entrances. Woo! Oh, my God. Do it, Joe. Yeah. Yeah, suck it, America. Dark Brandon's in the ring. Oh, my fucking God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. His face looks so weird. It's probably like the face scan they use, but... Play, please don't try this at home. Yeah. Oh, gee, who do you think this is? Tomato Man, or... Oh, God, that was... What a great entrance. Iconic. Oh, my God. Oh, fucking Lord. There he is. There's Kane. Uh, classic Kane. Woo! And introducing the challenger oh my god. Jesus. As the title gets into position here, let me remind everybody that the only way to win this <laughs> Yo, that guy's excited. The gold. That's right. No oh man. No submissions, no count outs. Oh, that was so good. That was so fucking good. Successfully ascend the ladder and take possession of the title. But I assure you, it's not quite as easy. Oh my god. Once again, YouTube or mainly Twitch chat, you're just coming in. The reason there's no music is I have it muted for um so I can upload this to YouTube. And have it not get dinged by copyright. So just imagine the music in your head. Oh, shit. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's Tomato Man. <laughs> Oh, wait, yeah, I could maybe play the, the Fortnite thing. Hold on, Victory Royale, wait. Hold on. Wait, is that copyrighted? We might, I mean, we're going to find out. Hey, if it's copyrighted, I'll just uh, cut this. All right, so hopefully I didn't have to cut that. I wonder how that kid's doing today. Oh, well, he's in a scuba suit because he's constantly drowning in pussy. All right, the Pikachu belt is on the line. All right, here we go. Kane versus Joe Biden versus Tomato Man for the Pikachu belt. It is a ladder match. Anything is possible in a ladder match. This is going to be over in 15 seconds or an hour and a half. You never know with the AI. Thankfully, there's only three of them. We will be doing a ladder match with eight people later. Okay, Joe, what the fuck are you doing? Dude, we got to have Joe Biden every match. He's a wild card. He doesn't know where he is or what he's doing. 
She's doing flips and shit to nobody. He's fighting ghosts. Biden is just happy to be there. That's not lined up, is it? No, you're like way off. Oh, maybe not. All right, this might be a quick one. This might be over immediately. Joe, what are you doing? He's going to win. Joe. There we go. Okay. Was that four of five locks? This match is almost over already. The entrances are going to take longer. Oh, that might, it might be over. K might just be able to go get it. Uh-oh, wait, Tomato Man. Sleepy Joe thinks it's the Royal Rumble. He might. Uh, Tomato Man, you could just win right now. You're just watching with the chair. Tom okay, he doesn't want the... Okay, I think he heard me. Tomato Man. Tomato Man's just gonna win! Joe Biden, what the fuck are you doing? Wait, Tomato Man, just grab it. He's gonna... Hey, the entrance just took longer. Fucking American Nightmare's right. Well, Tomato Man retains. Oh my god. I still think the best worst match was when we had a table match. It was only one table, not two tables. And it was over in like 15 seconds. It was so bad. <laughs> we, we maybe should have done a Hell in a Cell. Uh, anyway. I think we'll leave ladder matches for eight man because there's a lot going on. All right, let's do a uh, let's do a two on two here. We'll do a, just a, a, a normal tag match to, to cleanse the palate a little bit. We'll do a, we'll, we'll do a little one here. Do a normal tag match. Nothing too crazy. Let's do uh let's do a female tag. Okay, let's see who we can have here. Let's get. Oh, let's get Cynthia, and we'll get Cynthia and Misty. Oh, God, the ghost of Misty's going to show up. Oh, hold on. Texture my wife. Oh, okay. One second, gamers. Oh, you know what? No, Cynthia and Angelica, I do like a little bit more. For the joke. Um, Can I, like... There we go. Jesus Christ. Also, it allows me to not have to look at Misty again. And then, let's see. We could do Taylor Swift and Nicki Minaj. We could have, like, musicians. We have Samus as well. Kind of want to throw a Pokemon in there because she was eliminated in roughly 12 seconds. Let's do... Oh, well, we're going to put Hasuni Miku back in, first of all. That's that's a given. And... Oh, we could do Hasuni Miku and Barbie. That's a weird mix. Miku and Taylor. <laughs> oh, the musicians. Oh, wait. Uh, here we go. All right. Here we go. No title match, nothing. Just, uh... Just a normal fight. I guess we'll leave entrances on again for this one because I'm kind of like into it now. But uh, here you go. Here's another picture for you. This is a this is a screenshot. Why not Misty and Cynthia? Because Angelica has a doll in Rugrats called Cynthia, so it's kind of a play on that. But it's obviously not this Cynthia. <laughs> All right, who do you got? Angelica and Cynthia or Miku and Taylor Swift? This is battle music, but. Hey, if you can believe it, I'm not going to play a Taylor Swift song. Just pick your favorite and just listen to it in your head. Why? Because I want this video to get uploaded. <laughs> oh, she's gone. 
Oh, I need the Rugrats theme. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I'm not ready. And her partner, there she is. Los Angeles, California, America's sweetheart, Angelina Phillips. I don't know if you agree with it, but this superstar isn't afraid to come out here and take things by force. Oh, you hypocrite. I'll just wait until another superstar, one you don't like, Saxton, decides to come out and take what they want. Splat. Oh, she did the splat there. That would have been perfect. Hell yeah. Should have used all grown up theme. I don't think the all grown up theme is hits as hard. Also, I honestly don't remember what it sounds like. All right. Angelica and Cynthia. And I don't know if Hatsino Miku is, uh, uh, and if the music's copyrighted, so I'm not going to do it. Don't worry. I'm sure they'll hear you when they watch this match 10 times before bed tonight. 1 billion percent, yeah. Also, did you see the spelling on that? I think the spelling on her name was wrong. I didn't alter the spelling of her name. That was... When I, when I searched this on Creative Wrestler, I just typed in Miku. So I guess I picked the easier thing to spell because they fucked that up. She is really There's something about her face. Yeah, you know, it's not perfect, but you know who it is. You get, you get the gist. Some of these look... Be oh, hey. Yeah, let's go. Some of these look better than others. Scorgy, thank you for the 11 jinx. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Fan Diddley Annual, Emperor, Gabby, Dr. Scholl, Silver Stripe, Justin, uh, Plaid Warring Lesbian, Mashu, Big Milk, Ander. I think, I, I think that's everyone. Sorry if I missed you. She's so powerful. She's so powerful. Once again, this is just for Tina. And from Erie, Pennsylvania, Taylor. The WWE Universe already reaching a fever pitch upon their arrival, and we are just seconds away. We are just seconds away. She's from Erie? I don't know if that's correct. I know she's from Pennsylvania originally. I know way more about Taylor Swift than I ever thought I would know because of Tina. Uh, let's look it up. So Wikipedia. She, she is, is from West Reading, Pennsylvania. I don't know where that is in relation to Erie. Maybe that's the only... Because there's some, like, set names in this game. Maybe that was the only one for Pennsylvania. Anyway, here we go. Oh, by the way, she's at the Chiefs game right now. Taylor Swift. Because she's uh, allegedly seeing uh, Travis Kelsey. Uh, the Chiefs are up 34 to nothing. So she picked a good game to go to. They are playing the Bears, though. Which have a running back at quarterback. So, oh my god, Jesus. All right, I'm looking at this now. Miku. Once again, this is just a normal tag match. Nothing too crazy here. Oh, gee, I thought the fucking ref was going to, like, spear Angelica there. The ref is going crazy. What is the ref doing? Jesus. God, Miku is showing no fucking mercy here. All right, Angelica finally showing some offense here. 
Ooh. Oh, the knees to the face. Jesus. Tied up with a rip cord. Ooh. Oh my gosh, she's kicking her right in the fucking forehead. The game is so bad, Fox flex it out. Oh, the Bears Chiefs game? Yeah, I, I literally just looked, it was like 34 to nothing, but I think someone in chat said just scored again, so it's like 40 to nothing. Oh, a little slap in the face. And is Angelica gonna go for the tag here? Actually, Angelica's health got back further there quicker than I thought. All right, she just ran into Miku. Damn! Angelica practicing these moves on Tommy Pickles. She's she's ready to go. She is going all out. What's up, Adam Baker? Cynthia's back in. Or not back in. She's in for the first time. Taylor Swift is in. We got blonde on blonde action. Oh, Jesus. They both went for a kick. That was kind of anime style. Here we go. Good dodge by Taylor. Taylor. Oh, kicked in the face of Cynthia. All right, Taylor, that's a little... Angelica doesn't even come out because she knows. She knows that's a little early. All right, Cynthia wants no more of Taylor Swift. She tags in Angelica. Angelica's health hasn't even refilled yet. Oh, all right. I do like that they got uh, the tights right for Angelica. Those weird blue and green spot things. Oh, what's the prediction like for this? 51 for Miku and Taylor. 49 for Angelica and Cynthia. Pretty close. Oh! Miku not coming out to help. Okay, she's a little late, but there she is. Oh, elbows to the top of the head. Yikes! All right. Big kicks by Taylor Swift. Beating up a child. Good reversal from Angelica. Ooh. Oh. Damn, Angelica. Angelica's the best wrestler here. Oh, what a reversal. Looked like Taylor was going for a spear there. Ooh, Taylor kicks out. I, I mean, I can. She's hurt. She's not that hurt. Uh-oh, oh, Angelica. Oh, Taylor's crawling to Miku. Miku, help me. Miku! Wait, Taylor, you're right there. Just tag Miku. Or don't. Oh! All right. Angelica getting Cynthia back involved. Cynthia, you're in a good spot here. Taylor's a little, uh... Never mind. Big spear from Taylor Swift. I was about to say, Taylor's tired. All right. Miku is back in. Oh, good reversal. Oh, damn. Oh, but Miku got up immediately. That tombstone did nothing. Oh, over the top rope, Miku. Jeez. The no, <laughs> no sell, no sell. Oh, haven't seen this in a long time. The old Dude, Cynthia is not doing well. She's a better Pokemon trainer than she is a wrestler for sure. All right, getting back in the ring here. All right, I don't know what Mika was doing there, but Cynthia finally showing some offense. Angelica, oh, she's going for the tag on Angelica. Angelica's at full health again. Her body hurts a little bit, but she's got, uh, what, almost two finishers charged up? Uh-oh. Oh. Uh, Cynthia, where are you going? Cynthia? C Cynthia? Okay. Oh, wait, or was that on Taylor? I don't know, or I don't know who was hurt in that maneuver. I think it was Angelica, but I actually don't know. Anyway, Cynthia went to go fight. Oh, someone's stunned. Who's stunned right now? Oh, Cynthia's stunned. Miku! Oh, 
overshot just a smidge. Yeah, right on the tailbone. All right, that was a good chance to take out Angelica. Angelica's pretty dominant here. Her blue bar is filled up. I forgot what that means. Going for the pin. I think Miku's fine. Yeah, Miku's fine. But Taylor is stunned right now. Cynthia actually did something. Uh-oh. Oh, Taylor, you got to get up. Miku is in... Might be in trouble here. Oh! All right. Cynthia getting the tag. Is Taylor Swift back on the apron? Oh, very nice. Very nice from Miku. Don't pin. All right, little elbow drop to the titty. All right, Taylor Swift getting back in. Okay, this is a good match. It's at three and a half stars according to the game's rating. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, right in her fucking head. Yo, can I beat... Oh, Angelica coming out the bushes. Bruh. Angelica was on that immediately. Can, can I be Cynthia? Cynthia. She died for our Cynthia's. <laughs> Tag me in. All right. So, uh, Taylor came in, did some damage. Cynthia's not looking good here. Oh. Okay, I didn't think so. All right, Cynthia wisely tagging back in Angelica. Oh, jeez, immediately. Yeah, right, these teams have gone to war. Oh, okay, Miku changed her mind. Oh, my fucking God. All right, Taylor, you need to come in. She's stunned. Good save by Taylor. Good save. Uh-oh. The blondes are at it. Oh, <laughs> there she goes. All right, she's stunned right now. This might be it. Oh, this might be it. This might be it. Oh, uh, she, she submitted. Angelica and Cynthia are the winners. Damn it. She, like, busted up her chin and then right into a submission. Dude, who would have thought Angelica is a fucking demon? God damn. Cynthia wins by association, but I don't think she did anything. Well done. Weak chin Miku. That was a good match. That was a good one. Cynthia's a champion for a reason. Well, she, like I said, she's a better... She's, she's a better battler than she's a wrestler. Well done. Amazing match. I'd agree. Hey, at the very least, at the end there, um, Cynthia kept Taylor distracted. All right, we'll do a normal, another little palate cleanser one-on-one -on -one here. Let's just get a random match. Hey, once again, maybe we'll get an interference, but probably not. Let's get uh let's get Charles in. We'll get Charlie White. We'll get him in. And who else can we throw in here? Uh let's see. Let's get someone from the last time we played. Oh, I guess Markiplier would be good. A YouTuber fight, YouTuber battle. That would make sense. Uh we could also do Ninja. Could do ninja. I might do ninja. <laughs> um. Yeah, let's do ninja. Let's do ninja. Because we saw Markiplier do really, really well. So Markiplier might be in a future match of some sort. Like a title match, rather. We'll see how this plays out. Charlie White versus Ninja. All right, prediction is live. YouTuber, or I guess content creator battle, right? Because they both stream and do YouTube. Markiplier versus Springtrap. Oh, that could be a good one. That could be a good one. 
Or maybe they team up because he is one of the FNAF guys. There he is, baby. The moistest man on the internet. It's scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Tampa, Florida. Markiplier. Oh, yeah. I guess Markiplier and Matt Pat against, like, Freddy Fazbear and, like, I don't know. Foxy could be good. <laughs> All right. 66% of people. All right. It's going down now. It's like 60% for Charlie and, like, 40% for Ninja. Guys, do, do I have to remind you? Dude, he's got a book. He's not going to lose. He's got a book. Chat, let's get that dub. He's going to win. Let's get that dub. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high. If Ninja loses, can you burn the book? Uh, no, that is my Bible. How fucking dare you? I'll ban you. Oh, here he is. The gamer of all time. Ninja. The fucking in-game announcer. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> they know. See what they've got then. They know. Oh, God damn, he's going to give Charlie Ligma? True. God, do you remember when everyone said Ninja had Ligma a couple of years back? What, what a great time that was on the internet. Everyone just said he had Ligma. What a time. What a time to be alive. He had it back then. He still has it, but he also had it back then. True. True. All right. Here we go. Oh, I don't think I increased the interference, but it never happens anyway, so it doesn't really matter. All right, here we go. Oh, Charlie immediately with the German suplex. Charlie was a really good champ in uh, WWE 2K22. I think he defended his belt a couple of times. But of course, my favorite moment is none other than him just hitting Batman in the balls with a bat like seven times in a row. That is one of my favorite 2K22 moments. I have it on the schedule, by the way. I think sometime next year we'll do a... Uh, We'll do a, a high. We'll do a comp for WWE 2K22. Ninja not doing anything right now. Uh oh, Charlie's going up. Oh. <laughs> it's like he fell off. I think to get an interference, one of the participants has to be in a stable. Oh, really? That'd be weird. If true. Oh, Ninja just stomping on him. Oh. It was a misclick. Oh, okay. Charlie getting out. Okay, they both miss back to back. Rope break. Oh, Jesus. A nice shot of Charles's grundle there. Charlie looking good in the health department. He's like, he activated something so his health come, comes back. I wish I actually played this game so I knew more how the game worked instead of just assuming, but I've never played a second of 2K22 or 2K23. All I've done is just simulate. No way. Yeah, barely a one. Yo, this creator clash is fire. Ooh. Right in his face. 
This is an outfit that I think Ninja would own. And maybe wore on stream sometimes. Oh! Wow, that connected. We obviously know this is an outfit Charlie wears. He has the most white shirts of everyone on Earth. Oh! Doesn't Charlie have a major arsenal of firearms? Uh, probably. He lives in Florida, right? He's Florida man? I'd be upset if he didn't have at least 10 weapons. Wait, are we counting, like, his sex toy collection, too, or, like, actual guns? Ooh, right in his back. His guns have guns. Ninja was on the offensive there, and they took a break, and now Charlie. Ooh. Ooh, that's a pin. Ooh, Ninja kicks out. Ninja kicks out. Uh-oh. All right, Ninja's just <laughs> running around the ring. Whoa, hey, hey, Ninja's trying to hit the woman. Hey, whoa, Ninja, come on. We all saw it. Whoa. Bro, she's the ref. Sheesh. Anyway. Charlie actually puts the dildos on the AR like a bayonet. That's fair. They probably do more damage. Oh, man. Ninja Believers, you're looking good right now. He's got two finish or a finisher and almost... Oh, yeah, almost two finishers locked and loaded. This could be it. Not looking good for Charles here. Oh, Ninja. Here we go. Ninja talking shit. No, oh, he hit him. A dive and he nailed him. What would the final prediction end up being? 40% for Ninja, so pretty decent payout if he wins. Obviously, it's not over yet, but it's looking real good for Ninja. Oh, oh, he's stunned out there. Could be a count out. Oh. Jeez. Please tell me this goes to count out. Nope. All right. Charlie's back in. Not looking good. Ninja's almost at three finishers. He's going up high. Oh, that might be it. That might be it for Ninja. Or for Charlie. He kicks out. That was a long count. Either way, Charlie's still in. Ninja going back up. Oh! Huge roll out of the way for Charlie. All right. Got him in a submission. Let's see. There's no way he taps. There's no way. That Okay, he reversed it. Oh, Charlie trying to bring it back. But Ninja, just like back in his Fortnite days, very, very dominant. All right, he's going oh, to try it again. Round two. Round two. Here we go. Oh, he hit it. That might be it. I think that's it, gamers. Oh, wait. She doesn't know where to go. I think he's so good. That's it. What a dominant performance from Ninja. God damn. Dude, dominant. Dominant performance. Uh, he's doing some weeb shit in the ring. I don't know what he's doing. He's fucking no women, no jutsu right now or some shit. Great match. Three and a half. This script is terrible, dude. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. All right, let's do, uh, let's do a war games. Let's do a war games. And then the winning team will do a fatal four way for the, uh, the Taco Bell belt. Do a four and four. It's more chaotic. Uh, we'll do Survivor War Games, Survivor Series War Games. But who do we pick? The advantage is random, of course. We'll turn entrance off because it's probably going to take a while. Uh, oh, dude, give me the WCW referee. Yeah, entrance is off and everything else is the same. Okay. 
All right. So these teams will be completely random. I don't think there's going to be any kind of theme here. All right. Let's. Oops. Custom superstars. Let's see. I forget we have 50 cent. Oh, we could have. Oh, wait. What does Waka's thing say? I can't. I never even saw his portrait. Hold on. What does Waka's thing say? It says, damn the Outback. <laughs> no shot. It says, damn the Outback. Hold on. Hold on. Let me quickly go back to Let me go to a singles match so we can see it more clearly. Hold on. Um. Oh my god, did they actually- is that his portrait? Uh... Uh... <laughs> it is! <laughs> of fucking course that's his portrait, dude! Oh, Waka, you fucking racist. Oh... What a fun surprise that was. <laughs> Alright, anyway, back, back to what we were doing. Four on four. Oh my god. Okay. So, created superstars. Uh, I kind of wouldn't mind Wario back in there. Oh, you know what? We could have Onion Knight and Solaire, but put them on different teams. I kind of I kind of like that idea. Split up the boys. Um since this is Survivor, put on Jeff Probes. Oh, man. If I downloaded Jeff Probes, yeah, I would. Dude. Um, We could do Shadow Heartless. Why not? Who else can we put in here? God, his portrait is so big. <laughs> it takes up the whole thing. Ooh, Sound Fool. Thank you for the redemption. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um... Uh, actually, I wouldn't mind putting good old Jiminy Cricket in here. Listen, Solaire's a Souls character. Jiminy Cricket's kind of a Souls character. Shadow Heartless is not at all a Souls character, but it's Kingdom Hearts. People like that. And... Let's do... Hmm... We'll put Jack in on this team as well. And then over here, we'll put, obviously, uh, here we go. We'll put Onion Knight. And then who else can we throw in here? Like I said, once again, these teams are completely random. Ooh, I kind of want to put Barry in. Good old Barry Burton. No, I'm, I'm turning entrances off. I'm so sorry. Entrances will take fucking forever because there's eight of them. We could do Sands. And last but not least. Hmm. There's so many good options. Could do Ghostface. Um, we could do Ono Michio as well. Oh, actually, we have Libido. I still have Libido, right? I have Libido. Yeah. All right. So we have... Uh, what series are represented here? Okay. We have Dark Souls with Solaire and Onion Knight. We have Kingdom Hearts with Jiminy Cricket and the Shadow Heartless. And technically, Jiminy Cricket is Lies of P. We have Hotline Miami with Jacket. We have Barry Burton with Resident Evil. We have Undertale. And we have, of course, Yakuza or Like a Dragon. What a goddamn team we have here. Uh, I'm going to quickly run to the bathroom while you guys get your prediction going. I will be back in a minute. Prediction is live right now, so good luck. And YouTube, I'll be right back. All right, YouTube, we're back. Predictions are up. Team 1 has 49%. Team 2 has 51% of the votes. Let's get to it. There is so much happening on screen right now, you can't even see everything. But here's another funny screenshot for you. There you go. Did I see how cute Taylor looks at the game? Tina, Taylor looks cute all the time. I wish she was in a Steelers jersey, but I guess I'll take a Chiefs jersey. This is my new desktop background. Hell yeah.
All right, gamers, here we go. Mono e mono. These guys are brothers. Not really, but they're from the same video game. Solaire versus Onion Knight. The winning team will do a fatal four way for the very coveted Taco Bell Championship. Here we go. You'd never rig a match, would you? I have no way to do that. This is all AI. All right. Here we go. Oh, look at Mr. Libido in there with Barry and Sands. On the left, my face cam's blocking it. You can see Jimmy Cricket, uh, the Heartless, and a fucking Jacket. All right, who is the better Souls character? These guys are iconic Dark Souls 1 characters. Guys, are there any iconic Dark Souls 2 characters? Besides, like, the credits so you know it's over? Anybody? Dark Souls 2? I don't know anything about Dark Souls 2. I just know people hate it. Or most people hate it. Alright, the Shadow Heartless is coming up next. It looks like Team 1 will be getting the advantage here. God, Solaire's going in right now. All right, here comes the Shadow Heartless. There he is. Here we go. What is the Heartless bringing in? It's a Keyblade. Oh, it's a table. Oh, okay. Solaire is going up high. Can the Heartless even get that in? Oh, he can. He slides it in. All right, what's Solaire going to do here? Uh, nothing. He's climbing down. What a, what a pussy. Oh, now Onion Knight's going up. What are we doing? Okay, uh, the Heartless is getting another table? Oh, are you going to get a... If you get a third table, I'm going to lose my mind. Oh, a kendo stick. Okay, thank you for mixing it up. He made a kendo sandwich with table bread. All right, now that you brought every single weapon in the world into the ring. Okay. Just fucking bonked Onion Knight in the head with the fucking <laughs> the table. Okay, you spent all that time bringing them the tables. All right, reversal tables back in the ground. Barry Burton is the next one in for team two. All right, the table has been set up by the Heartless. He hasn't done anything yet. He's just running. He's just running around. He's like happy to be here. All right, here comes Barry. He needs to help out Onion Knight. He is, uh, he's taking some damage here. Not as much as he could potentially be taken, but... <laughs> what the fuck is the Heartless doing? What is he doing? Barry's in. No weapons because of the whole arsenal in here. All right, Barry's grabbing the other table. Setting it up on the left ring. Here comes Solaire. Ooh. Okay. Solaire. Uh oh. Is Barry going to go through the table that he just set up? Uh oh. I think Barry's going through the table. Barry? No, oh, Barry just goes right through the table. So there goes that. That was a good use of the table, Barry. Oh, so Jesus. Solaire's showing no mercy. And the, the heartless is kind of just there, I guess. Oh, the kendo stick on Barry. The man has a family. Oh, oh, Barry is really getting fucked immediately. Oh, Barry, Jesus. Okay, that's broken. God. Okay, Barry's back. Jimmy Cricket's coming, coming for team one. The Heartless is stunned. But Solaire has full health and, like, no damage to him on his body. Onion Knight has some head damage. Uh oh, is the Heartless going to go through the table? Oh, the Heartless. It's time! Then the Heartless goes to the table. That's for Kyrie or whatever. All right, Jimny Cricket. All of the weapons are gone, but Jimny's in the ring. Oh, dude, Solaris. Kicking ass here. So if I remember correctly, this match doesn't end 
until all four members of both teams are in, and then it's the first one to, like, pinfall or submission or whatever. So this is all bullshit until all the teams are in, or all the members are in. Yeah, okay. Bro, Barry is getting bullied right now. All right, oh boy. Heartless is climbing the ropes. Just kidding. I got you. Jiminy's climbing the ropes. Solaire and Shadow have climbed the ropes, or climbed the cage, but Jiminy's climbed the rope, the, the cage. Is he going to do anything? Here we go. Jiminy Cricket. Jiminy Cricket. Right. Oh, my. If you jumped onto all of that armor, your ribs would explode. The Cricket Splash. All right, Sands is coming up next. That means Jacket and Mr. Libido will be your final members for each team. Right now, hey, looking at the health, Team 1, this looks unfair. Team 1 is dominating right now. Good Lord. I guess there's three of them and two of Team 2, but all right, here comes Sands. The great equalizer. The great equalizer. Uh, Carthon? Okay, cool. Thank you. All right, Jimny. Okay, not going up. Sands? Sands is bringing in the sledgehammer. He's going for another weapon. Jimny climbing the cage as well. I'm trying to keep track of everything. There's so much. Oh, great. Another table. That's why we need a third one. Jimny again? Oh, my God. On Jesus. On United is like dead. All right, Sands is getting another weapon. He gave a table to the other team. He's bringing in a chair now. God damn, all right. Yeah, uh, Onion Knight, I think, is dead. Barry is close to death. Here comes Sans, the great equalizer. Though Barry is finally fighting back. Okay, big miss by Jiminy. Heartless, once again, doesn't know what to do with the table besides go through it. Oh, Sledgehammer is down. Okay, Barry and Sands double team and Solaire here. That's what they need to do. Solaire's looking real, real good. He's got three finishers. All right, but Jacket is coming in. All right. <laughs> Shadow Heartless has set up another table. Oh, a sledgehammer to the spine of Solaire. Oh, Solaire's getting it now. Here comes Jacket. He knows how to use a sledgehammer. I know that from the video game. Okay. Oh, Solaire is getting destroyed right now. Holy shit. Mr. Libido, the last man in the cage. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Is Onion Knight going through a table? Oh, Solaire is dying over there on the left side. Oh, Solaire. I'm sorry. Onion Knight through the table. And then a backflip. Okay, Jacket missed the backflip. That was cool. Oh! Okay, Ray, remember when Solaire had full health and his body was, like, not damaged at all? Uh, what's up with Barry's arm? Oh, oh, Barry's arm is broken. It, uh, Barry's arm... $70 game, by the way. His, his arm is kind of glitchy. Don't worry about it. He's a PlayStation 1 character. That happens. His arm is super fucked. Now Jacket climbing the cage. Team 2 kind of made it. Well, I'm not sure if they made a comeback. They just beat the shit out of Solaire. All right, the War Games is officially going to begin in seven seconds, chat. All right. This is going to be interesting. If they keep targeting Solaire, he's over there by himself. It might be a dub, but we'll see. Oh, what is Libido grabbing? Another kendo stick. See, he gra he's grabbing more. That sledgehammer is killing Solaire. Oh, my God. All right, Libido's grabbing a table. Mr. Libido's grabbing a table. Jacket. Nope. So it's 3v1. All right, War Games has officially started. It's 3v1 on both sides. Both Dark Souls characters are in hell right now. Let's see what happens. 
get the pin. It might be right there. They're distracted. This is weird how it separates. It's going to be the first one to pin the Dark Souls character will win, I think. No one likes Dark Souls anymore, no. Everyone's mad because FromSoft made a robot game instead of Dark Souls 4 or Elden Ring 2. Oh my god, we have some action in the center of the ring now. Or of the rings. Alright, Jacket for some reason crawling or climbing to the other side. Oh, Jimmy Cricket. Alright, now we got some crossover. Onion Knight getting a second win? Or uh, probably like an eighth win at this point. He's like gone through a lot. All right, it's going to be hard for me to keep track of everything going on, but I'll do my best. Libido fucking up Solaire. Now fighting Sans. Barry's taking a nap. Jiminy's getting it. Nope. Good reversal over there. This reminds me of the castle level in Super Mario World. Oh, when they're climbing on the cage? Yeah. They hit the cage to flip to the other side. All right, Libido's going up. Oh, five subs away from 12,000 subs. Thanks, gamers. Oh, Jiminy! Nope. Game still goes on. Or the match still goes on. But we're five away. Thank you. Oh, a jump! Oh, that could be it. If Libido goes for the pin, that could be it. Oh, wait, no. Jacket's on the other team. No pin from Libido. I can't even see who's stunned over there. Oh, it's still Solaire. Oh, that could be it! That could be it! He kicked out! I can't believe he kicked out. Wow. Oh, that's got to hurt on Jacket. Oh, now Libido is pinned. No, Libido kicks out. Yo, Cats, thank you for the five gifted subs. Over oh, 12K subs. Or we're at 12K subs. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, Barry's pinning. Nope, never mind. Kicked out. Or, uh, you know, he got kicked off of it. I have no idea how Solaire's even standing up. His bones are all dust. He got destroyed by a sledgehammer for it. Felt like an hour. Onion Knight climbing up. Oh, Jiminy. That was kind of cool. All right. Onion Knight is on top of the cage. What's he got playing? Let's see it. Oh! Right on Jacket. Sands is also stunned now. So is Barry. Shadow Heartless doing... I thought it was going to be an F5. We got a pin on Libido. He kicks out. All right, all right. Oh, who's pinned right now? Oh, it doesn't matter. Oh, this might be it. This might be it. No, Shadow Heartless protecting his homie. Got a power bomb from Solaire. Oh, Jacket is stunned again. That could be a pin. But for some reason, he's focused on Jiminy Cricket. Yo, Hiccup, thank you for the 102. Oh, Sands is setting up the table for whatever reason. Or he's just swinging it randomly. I don't know what's happening. Yo, Sand feet for free? Uh, somebody's pinned. I can't see. Oh, Libido was pinned. The match continues. Jacket is dazed. We have six people in one ring and two in the other one. Oh, big kick from Heartless into Libido. We got a suplex. Oh, no. Reversal from Jiminy. That table is not set up, by the way. It's like halfway set up. By the way, shout out to the two refs in the back by the cages. They had to do it to him. Libido on the ground. He's being mounted by the Heartless. Oh, he's in a submission? Libido might tap. Libido might tap. He tapped. He tapped! Team one, I believe, is the winner. I can't... Yeah, team one. Jiminy Cricket, Solaire, Jacket, and the Shadow Heartless. Oh, my God, on a tap. Dude, nobody was over there. Nobody was over there. They weren't paying attention to Libido. Uh, and Jiminy Cricket, let's make sure I write everybody down. What a match. I can't believe Solaire survived. What a... Look at all the debris. Team 1 is the winner. God damn. What a great match. Solaire went through 15 flasks. He did.
He did. All right, fatal four way for the belt. Uh, we'll do a fatal four way. Um, let's do an extreme rules match, and then yeah, we'll do it at in your house. Why not? Can we make it to uh, two pinfalls? Watch, we'll also have them come on in. Let's do world class referee. Ooh, only the best. Two out of three falls. Yes, absolutely. Uh, Solaric died five times. Motherfucker got invaded. He did. Uh, Pinner submission will allow both. Falls count anywhere. No, you have to do it in the ring. Yeah, that looks good. Cool. All right, let's get our competitors in here. All right, prediction is live. So good luck, gamers. Uh, okay, so first off, we need Solaire. He's in. Then we need Jacket. He's in. And then Shadow Heartless, the winner, technically, won it for the squad. Uh, here we go. I know my ABCs. And Jiminy Crickets. All right, arena's chosen, entrance on, title match on. The championship will be for the vacant. Oh, I can't. Oh, this isn't a title match. Oh, because I have to give it to somebody. Okay, so it is a title match, but there's no title, if that makes sense. Whoever wins will get it. Um, okay. Make sure everything's good. I think we're all set. Here we go. And then here is your... <laughs> Here's your fucking new wallpaper. <laughs> Extreme. I love it. I love it, dude. Quickly checking Twitter while we got some time. The prediction is live. You guys got a minute to vote. Who is going to win the Taco Bell belt? The Taco belt, if you will. XGA, Mathman, Cavalier, Tolleran. Oh, shit, they give him a sword. That's cool. Hiccupville with the 102. Thank you, gamer. Solaire, here we go. Whose intro is this? This is pretty sick. Hope it's someone that doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's Rikishi's. The following contest is a uh, Drew McIntyre. Ooh. I like how it's not a helmet. It looks like it's just like a fucking... <laughs> that is definitely not a helmet on his head. It's some, like, fucking cloth shit. Hey, where's the horse? What? The high horse yeah. superstar always seems to be on. The <laughs> that was some good commentary. That was funny. <laughs> it makes it funnier because he's a knight, and then it's a complete curveball to something else. People are booing Solaire? Bro, everybody loves Solaire. What do you mean? Is there anyone that doesn't like Solaire? He's a bro. It's the swagger. The audience are paid actors. All right, let's see uh, while someone else comes in next. 19% for Solaire, 37% for Jacket, 27% for Shadow Heartless, and 16% for Jimmy Cricket. Oh, dude, Spring Fox YouTube, that's smart. You put your, uh, you put your, your actual handle as the Twitter. That's smart. All right, here we go. It's gonna be good. That guy's hyped. Shout out to that guy. Yo, what's up, Luke? Look at the focus and drive in his eyes. Ready to prove it's about drive. It's about power. We stay hungry. We devour. That guy was like in my ear. <laughs> yeah. 
That directional audio, man. They got that shit locked up. Locked up. I don't know why I said locked up. I feel like Jack would not be this kind of in your face. I think he'd keep to himself. Oh yeah, I am pumped for this guy. That guy's a hotline Miami fan. That guy's actually me. All right, who's up next? Oh, there he is. <laughs> you know, that's kind of accurate to how they move. All right. This is a good intro. Just crawling around. And yeah, they're on all fours. Yeah, this is the boogeyman's intro, right? Doesn't he eat worms? Is he going to eat worms? Is Shadow Heartless? Oh, he's standing up. Oh, that's Solaire's thing. That's BM. Oh, people are booing him. People are not a fan. He is still not moved from the top of the ramp. Compulsive Shiny Collector, thank you for the three years. This intro takes a while. Yeah, it looks like he's barely moving. When I was, uh, when I asked about long entrances, where'd the stick come from? Oh, Hart Lee's, that's funny. That's close. Where did the... Yeah, this is the boogeyman, isn't it? Didn't the boogeyman have a stick? Or did it, did it switch halfway? What happened? The stick is bigger than him. Anyway, when I was asking about long uh, intros earlier, people said uh, Demon Finn Balor. I think that was who he is. Uh, it was a long one. They splice two intros? That's actually kind of smart, honestly. The stick is a little out of place. If you could hack in a keyblade, that'd be kind of cool, but... All right. Last but not least... <laughs> is Jiminy Cricket. <laughs> what do we got for Jim? <laughs> He's so cool. Look at the swagger of Jiminy Cricket. My God, it is fucking face. Yo, this goes hard. I'm changing my vote to Jiminy. They place a higher value on friendship than success. Yet another reason we're not friends. What the... Are the announcers okay? Is Butterbean okay? Images that go hard. Dude, he's got no ass. He's got like a Hank Hill ass. Yo, lady, the match hasn't started yet, all right? Jesus, let him get there. The announcers are getting testy with each other. Jeez, dude. Oh, Tina sent me a cute little message. I gotta respond to that later. He's physically and mentally prepared for the task at hand in this big time match. Oh, hold on, I found a good reaction. Okay. Okay. Here we go, gamers. Obviously, the best intro or best entrance so far, and it's not even close, was Joe Biden's. But Jimmy Cricket kind of went hard. All right, here we go. Fatal four-way. You need two pinfalls or submissions. Extreme rules for the Taco Bell belt. If you miss Joe Biden's entrance... Obviously, this is going to get uploaded tomorrow, and there's clips of it, so it'll be in the, uh, it'll definitely be in the, uh, the comp. All right, Jacket, first one to get a weapon. That makes sense. Oh, never mind. Shadow Heartless says no. I'm going to put it on TikTok? Okay, sounds good. There you go. 
praising the sun. We're like a minute into the match, Solaire. You may want to wait. Jiminy with the chair going after the Heartless. Or he's missed twice. He missed three times. Kid, I see four times? He dropped the chair. Way to go, Jiminy. Way to go. Oh, man, I would love for someone to go through the table. Not just to set the tone, but because coming from behind in this sort of match is the epitome of an uphill battle. Toss back into the ring. Come on, get some more weapons. Oh, that's my cricket. Solera and Jiminy not looking great right now. Jacket looking phenomenal. That chair is still standing, or still there for someone to use it. I believe I did put pinfalls in the ring, so no shenanigans outside. Oh, big move by Heartless there. By the Heartless. Jimmy's Cricket's legs are getting destroyed right now. Oh, right in his goddamn hat. I think that chair is broken. What happened to Jacket there? Let's see. Okay, they just ran into each other. Jimmy making a comeback. Oh, no way. There's no way that's one. No, he's kicking out of that. He's kicking out of that. Does taunting still raise your finisher? Uh, I think so. It either does that or, like, activates an ability. I assume that's why the AI does it. Oh, Solari is stunned a little bit. Okay, not quite, not quite. This match is already at three or two and a half stars, rather. Excuse me. Solaire, not looking good. Just like before in the war games, he was looking great. Now, not so much. Jacket has the steel steps. They are in the ring. They are inside Solaire. They're inside Jacket. Okay, now they're in the ring. Big DDT there. Oh, somebody's stunned. Oh, he's rolling out of the ring. Smart. All right, there's the sledgehammer. Oh, he doesn't want it anymore, I guess. Okay. All right. Oh, saving jacket there. Oh, Heartless is grabbing the ladder. Oh, my God. I love this. There was a there was a clip from last time we did this where Nightmare Bonnie tried to, like, dive onto someone and, like, hit the ladder. It was so good. It was very good. All right, Jiminy's got the sledgehammer. All right, this ladder is in an, uh, I like that they have to duck under it. Fucking limbo. Oh, right in his nutsack. All right, now ev everyone's hurting right now. Everyone's hurting. Jiminy Cricket does have some grin in his health bar, but... The ladder's getting, getting used. I love to see it. Oh, I think he wants to put him on the ladder, but there's too much happening. Is the ladder hovering? Uh, oh, it kind of looks like that, right? I think it's supposed to be on top of the table, but, you know. $70 game. It does look like it's hovering, without a doubt. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, Jesus. Sledgehammer. We got the ladder. We got the steel steps. A lot happening here. Oh. Jeez. Uh oh, what's this gonna be? I, I think they all want to like use the ladder. Okay. So Lara's back in. There's the steps are right there and they're out of the ring. Never mind. This is a slaughter, yeah. Oh, she ran to the barrier. Another one right into the barrier. These fans are getting an up-close look at these monstrosities. Another one on the barrier. Okay, he didn't fly into anything. Oh! Right in his ankle. Oh, the sledgehammer to Jiminy. He is not... No, he's not doing well. Oh, his ankles are shattered. Yeah, the ring announcers are unbothered. They're not even looking at the action. Oh, 
All right, the Heartless set off that ladder and keeps getting slammed into it. I don't think that's what he intended to happen. Torture rack again. I think he's taunting the Heartless. Fucking get out of there. All right, Jack in a Jimny, but he's taunt. Okay, he picked up the sledgehammer and dropped it again. Nobody in the ring yet. Remember, it is two pinfalls or submissions. All oh, right, the stairs, the stairs are still there. They're just off camera. They can't get in the ring because they, they keep hitting the stairs. Oops, someone's busted open. Once again, the stairs are in the way. Move the stairs or move over. There you go. For the first time in forever, someone's in the ring. Oh, and the stairs. He's, is he grabbing the stairs? All right, here come the stairs. Oh, my God. Right. The <laughs> Jimmy Cricket right in the fucking face. Oh, he's going crazy. He's hitting everybody with these stairs. God damn. Oh, he's, oh, he's popping off right now. Another one? Oh, the stairs are finally down. Damn. Dude, Jimmy Cricket getting hit by the stairs was very funny. All right, he's back in the ring. We have a lot of finishers on the board. Oh, not a lot of health. All right, what's Jimmy going to grab? Let's see. All right, kendo stick. Here comes the Heartless. He just dropped it. Amazing. You got to get in the ring, gentlemen. We got to get some... Okay. Jimny, you going in? No, he's going for another weapon. Oh, don't... Oh, another ladder. Great. Another... Oh. Oh, oh, there's another... Oh, no. That, wait, that's a... Wait, no. That's a second staircase. Jesus Christ. Well, whenever they get around to pinning someone, this is going to be interesting. Oh, good dodge from Jack. Never mind. His testicles are destroyed. Uh-oh. Here we go. Oh, right in the back. A choke slam in front of the fans. All right. Solaire, where are you going? All right, Limbo. Are you done with Jackie? You going to fight Jiminy and the Heartless? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Solaire's health is way high. Yeah, he's taunting against his ability, it looks like. Oh, you missed. <laughs> missed the kick, and boy, did you pay for it. Took it right to the mouth. Oh, here comes Jack with the stairs. The first set of stairs, I believe. You, Solaire missed the kick a second time, and he got hit by stairs this time. Jeez. Fuck, maybe I should have put Falls outside. These guys are, like, allergic to the inside of the ring. As I say that. Never mind. Nope, oh, never mind again. Never mind again. Jack, are you okay? You probably have, like, eight concussions stacked on top of each other. You don't know where you are right now. All right, Solaire is in. Will he be in there for long? Uh... The Heartless just picked up the kendo stick 12 times. Jimny's in. Someone else go in the ring. Oh, thank you. We might actually have some pins here. Oh! Uh-oh. He's mounting Jiminy. Oh, I think this is a pin. No, submission, submission. Is Jimny going to tap out? Here comes Solaire. Breaking it up. Okay. He finally realized what was going on. We have three people in the ring. Uh-oh. Is he setting up a spear? Nope. 
All right. Jacket, what are you grabbing? Oh, he's got the bat. Iconic weapon from Hotline Miami. He's dropped it. Fuck, if I knew this was going to take so long, I would have done one pinfall. Oh, good reversal. We got a couple of dazed wrestlers here. Oh, big reversal. Huge reversal. Ooh, kicked out, kicked out. That could have been three. Praise the sun. Yeah, if I had it on one, on one pin, it would have ended in 30 seconds. I know how this goes. I know better. Oh! Ooh, that was, that was unnecessary. Oh, he's grabbing the kendo stick. Oh, big chop. All right, our friends are outside the ring again. Ooh, almost a hit by the ham, the, uh, not the hammer, the bat. Oh, Solaire's laughing. And yep, <laughs> right to the post. There are nine finishers on the board right now. Holy Almost ten. Oh, Solaire saving the Heartless. What a nice guy. Oh, my God. Drop kicks for days for Jiminy. All right. Oh, Jiminy tried to go in the ring. Or maybe try to grab a weapon. I don't know. All right, every, everybody's getting thrown around. All right, he's in the ring. Jacket's in the ring. Jacket is out of the ring. He just went for the sledgehammer. Oh! Everybody's health is in the red. There's a little bit of green. Oh, great. here we go. Here comes the ladder. Okay, he's done with the ladder. Solaire is just running away. Just running away. He ran away to taunt. What a pussy. There are so many weapons everywhere. Everybody's outside the ring. No one has recorded a pin yet. Because they don't want to go in the ring. Oh, there's a big kick. Solaire finally landed a kick. He tried so many earlier. Another drop kick out of nowhere from Jiminy. He's just using his feet at this point. What are we doing? These guys are just beating the shit out of each other. Eventually, hopefully, they get back to the ring and get some pins going. Or submissions. Hey, that ladder on the right is still there. I'm still hoping it gets used. Just, yeah, this is just, just just a death match. Whoever dies first. I guess I could have put knockouts on as well. That probably would have counted for a couple at this point. We have two people in the ring. We have two people in the ring. Uh-oh. Oh, that might be one right there. That's one right there, I believe. Absolutely. I can't believe he kicked out of that. What? Also, someone made a good point. While they were fighting outside, the ref was just in the ring like, uh... What are we doing? Alright, Jimmy going for the pin! Broken up by the Heartless. Uh, going for a submission here. Okay, Heartless was just watching. Ooh, kick to the butt cheeks. Solari coming in. All four wrestlers are in the ring yet again. Heartless taking a nap. There are now. Oh. oh is he going over? Nope. Solari is the only one that's like alive. 
All right, reversal from Jacket. Oh, right on the ladder. Oh, submission. That's actually huge if he can get this. Jacket does have some health, though, but let's see. This could be a tap. This could be a tap. There's one tap, okay? Heartless is on the board. He's on the board with one. But Jacket is back in. Oh, on that ladder. Oh, he's going to jump on him. Let's see it. Let's see it, Jacket. Do it. Oh, oh, oh he broke the ladder. Heck, I busted. The ladder is broken. Jeez. That was sick. That was worth it. That was worth the wait. All right, so Heartless only needs one more pin or submission. The others do need two. You, you don't have enough weapons, Heartless? What? There's like 18 weapons on the left side of the map or the ring. Rachel. Thank you for the 87. Ooh. Oh, he's BM. He's laughing at him. He's laughing at him. Okay. Where'd the ladder go? Oh, uh, since it's broken, it just despawns. The tables do the same thing. All right, there's the whole arsenal of weapons. Jiminy grabbing the bat, which I don't think has been used yet. He's coming back around. I'm back, motherfucker. Okay, then he tried to run away, but a little late for that. He just scratches back. All right, Jacket in the ring. Soler in the ring now. Interesting. Ooh. And the Heartless is back in the ring. Okay. Jiminy, you coming in? Jiminy's in the ring with a bat. All right, Jacket is out. But he is stunned. Unfortunately, he is out of the ring, so nothing will happen there. A little choke slam. Let's see. Will this be a point for Solaire? No. I think he was kicking out of that anyway. Oh, the ref is down. I just realized the ref is down. The ref is down. Oh, he's getting back up. He's fine. Oh, no. He's, another ladder is set up. We've set up another ladder. Ref is fine. Ref is fine. Solaire's laughing at Lord knows what at this point. If these guys keep fucking around, Heartless can win here. Never mind. Jiminy, what are you doing? Jiminy? Solaire looks like he's dead right now. Broke a kendo stick on his back. Jiminy's slow walking. Gives Heartless plenty of time to get up. All right, two guys, three guys back in. The whole game's back in. All right. Let's see what happens. All right, you guys are just running around the ring. What is happening? Ooh. Oh, he's stunned. Oh, but he rolled out. What do you do? Oh, he's grabbing the bat. Okay. Again. Oh, big kick. Big kick on the heartless there. Uh, wait. Where are you going, Jacket? I can't believe it. Measuring it up one more time. All right, he's stunned, but there's nowhere you're gonna get a pin with these guys here. Oh, please tell me Jimmy goes to the pin and takes it. Oh no, he's setting up a special for some reason. Yep. You deserve that. He is still... Oh, maybe? Nope, took too long. You took too long. Solaire's like, I'm out of here for now. Let me recover. Jimmy's the same way. Oh, let's see. 
Jacket is on the board. One to one right now. Okay. Okay. Oh, if these guys are distracted, he might get another pin. Oh, wait. He might double up. He might double up. Oh, he did it. Jacket is the winner. Wow. Holy shit. What a fucking match. Dude, he truly is the hotline mammy. You're right. Oh my god, what a what a goddamn match. We we need to give him the belt. Holy fuck. 2 points in 30 seconds. That was that was wild. What a what a disaster. All right. Well, talk about championship. Goes to the one and only Jacket. Wait, what did I did I pick tag team? No, wait. Hey. Yeah, give him the belt. What do you... Hey, give him the belt. What do you mean? Oh, it's a tag belt. I'll have to fix that. I'll make a mental note. Why is that a tag belt? What? Let me just make a little mental note. I got to fix that off screen. Taco Bell belt to jacket. I'll fix that later. Maybe it won't be the Taco Bell belt, but he'll have a belt. I'm doing so well in fake money. Uh, Let's see. What can we do here? Let's do... Let's do another little chill singles match cuz that was a long one. Let's get a, let's get a shorter one in here. Yeah, the the tago belt, you're not wrong. Maybe a maybe a women's match. Let's do a women's match here for the ladies. We'll put Pokémane back in cuz she played for 2 seconds. And then who can we, who else can we put in here? Let's do I think all yeah, I think all the women played already. Oh, I forgot Ronda Rousey was a wrestler. Jesus. Uh, let's do... Who can we do here? We could have her refight Samus Aran, but... Or Aaron. I guess we could also do Rare Ripley. That could be fun. Oh, but I think the, the power difference might be an issue. I don't know how big of an issue that really is, but... Then again, she didn't really do very well last time, so who knows? Who knows? Uh, we'll do... I'm about to bust. We'll do Hank Hill. No, we'll do Rare Ripley. Why not? We'll see how much the, uh, the difference in, uh... I, I guess rating really matters. All right, there's your prediction. Oh, I guess uh, we'll do, uh, we'll, yeah, we'll have the entrance on, and we'll do the Great American Bash, America. All right, after this, we'll do a, uh, whoops, we'll do uh, an Elimination Chamber. We haven't done one of those yet. Uh, nobody made Chibi a fighter. The only VTubers I saw were uh, primarily Iron Mouse, and I think there's some other ones I didn't recognize. All right. You go to your first WWE show next week? Hell yeah. There's Pokey. The queen of Twitch. Oh, she has the headphones on. That's funny. Thank you, Tank Man, for 81 months. I sort of got if Pokey loses again in less than a minute, then I might as well just delete her because she's not doing anything, unfortunately. She can only hear these W's through the headphones. Well, I'm not sure if she had the headphones during the Royal Rumble because she didn't hear anything except her hitting the floor out of the ring. Ah, this woman's about to face the nightmare of the women's division. And you know Rhea Ripley yeah, will not yeah. let up the moment. Ezra, thank you for the 22. Ooh, Project, thank you for the brand new sub. 
Dr. Seward with the 102. Appreciate it. All right. Let's see how this goes. Hell yeah. Get ready for brutal judgment. Rhea Ripley is a tough, tough woman. Oh, that's her intro. Okay. Representing the judgment day. Oh, wow. Yeah, since she's an actual wrestler, she has like a proper... <laughs> she has a proper Rhea. thing. Oh, dude, back titties. Oh, wait, those are eyes. Shit. Light, edit that out. Physically imposing and a talented athlete. This is a woman who knows how to put her strength to devastating use. Uh, it's 50-50. Honestly, who's going to win this match? We'll see. We'll see. Is Judgment Day. Rhea, yeah, this is the one in the game. This isn't a creator wrestler. This is the one that's like, you know, within the game itself. Those spikes got to be an unfair advantage. Uh, she takes the jacket off. It's just part of her, uh, part of her, like, entrance outfit. There's a lot of people that wear spikes. Shout out to the, uh, what, Hawk and Animal from way back in the day with the football pads. The Legion of Doom. I think that's what they were called. All right, here we go. Nothing on the line here. This is just a, a palate cleanser. Pokey against Rhea Ripley. Okay, Pokey decides she wants to fucking fight today. Let's see. She did take the headphones off. Yeah, she, she didn't get eliminated so fast. True. Oh, she's going up. Oh, my God. Dude, is Ray even going to land a shot? Bro. What the fuck happened? This is like a different wrestler. Jeez. My God, indeed. This is this is hard to watch. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Here we go. Oh. All right, they're getting back in the ring. Oh, she's BMing, dude. Oh. All right, not quite yet, but she's getting close. Ray's not looking great. All right, take it, taking a breather, taking a breather. Okay. Oh, jeez. Hey guys, I think the ten more points in her stats is making a big difference. You guys said, or some people said it wouldn't, but I, I think it does. Can Pokemon do this IRL? Uh, yeah. Absolutely. I wish that was me. I wish that was me. All right, now Pokemon struggling. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, I know. Pokemon just lost all of her health. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, that might be it. That might be it. Kick to the fucking chin. Pokey's the winner. Jesus. Here is your winner. Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. Where was that in the rumble? Complete confidence and control of the situation. Hey guys, I think those 10 points counted. For future reference. I think it, they counted. Oh, whoops. My bad. That was just a quickie. A little quickie. A little palate cleanser.
All right, now we do something else that's super stupid. And we do, is it six? Six elimination chamber, right? Yes, okay. Uh, ooh, what belt should this be for? I guess whoever wins this can go against Bob. We'll have them go against Bob. You're back with Taco Bell? Let's go. 19 holiday. Thank you so much. All right, we'll get the uh, we'll get All Star Zombie. He hasn't been in yet. Random. I uh, will take the entrances off because it might take a while. Let's see, who else can we put in here? Oh, I feel like maybe Markiplier because Markiplier had such a good showing. I feel like he should be in. Throw Markiplier in there. Uh, who hasn't been used? All the new people have been used. It's the people people from last time I downloaded who haven't been used. Like, Aku hasn't been used, I think. Um, so I guess we put Aku in there. Aku! Oh, I got rid of Markiplier. Whoops. Could, could we... Could, could we work here, Ray? Is this your first time doing this, you fucking idiot? Why does it keep... Hey! Okay. Yes. Fucking what am I doing? Hold on. I think it's because I was player one over there and it's fucking up. Yeah, let me try that. Okay, these are all computers now. I think I fixed it. I think I'm just a fucking idiot. Yeah, okay, we're good. I'm, I'm dumb. Anyway, what was I saying? Markiplier? Hello, everyone. All right. Oh, what is the second outfit? Do I want to know? Is it Darkiplier? Guess we'll find out. Uh, E. All right. Could bring back Dave, a fan favorite. Oh, Fox McCloud hasn't gone. Neither has Ghostface. Get a little furry action. We'll get Ghostface in there. And then, who else hasn't, haven't we seen? We have the hurricane we can do. I think we've seen... Oh, we haven't, we haven't had Onimichio. We haven't seen Onimichio. We also haven't seen Shaggy or Snoop Dogg or Spider-Man 2099. But I'm feeling Onimichio. Onimichio, here we go. All right. So the winner here will fight, um, will fight Bob. What a, once again, what a cast of characters. All right. The prediction is live. Uh, title match off, entrance off. Let me just make sure everything else is good here while you guys gamble. Uh, we'll do a female SmackDown 09 referee. Why not? Uh, arena doesn't matter. Custom match rules. KO off. False count anywhere. Oh, you could change the entrance interval. Um, I think two minutes. Oh, we'll, we'll try 90 seconds. I don't want it to go too fast. Uh, they're all com computers. Yep. All right, here we go. You have Ghostface. What's up? You have Markiplier. Fox McCloud, Aku, Ono Michio, and the, uh, what was this, the all-star zombie from Plants vs. Zombies. With random entrances. Let's see how this goes. Gamers. It is Fox McCloud versus Aku. Oh my god, look at Mark's armor. He's got, like, Aku's armor. What the fuck is that that he's wearing? What? Yeah, you can gamble on mobile. 16 feet high, 30 
36 feet wide. I'm not blind, Corey. It's right. All right, here we go. I like the fucking doge head that Fox is wearing. Aku is so tall. <laughs> He's so tall. Mark is wearing a tire too. I don't fully understand the lore of it, but that's what he's wearing. Also, since there's no way for me to proc the money in the bank, whoever wins this will obviously fight Bob, but we'll also have Squirtle. And we'll have it so like he's, you know, using his money in the bank. So it'll be a triple threat match. Maybe Hell in the Cell. Hell in the Cell triple threat match. Maybe uh, two pinfalls or whatever. If we can do that. Extra thick. True. Wow, what a throwback. Throwback meme. JP, thank you for the six months. Okay. Fox is just flipping her. Ooh. With his goddamn cyber legs. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right, who's the next one in? Let's see. Who do we got? Everyone's excited. Number three is... Oh, it's Markiplier in his weird fucking armor. Here he comes. The glasses, I think, are off, though. E. I don't know if there's any, like, Markiplier lore that he's wearing this, or this is some kind of OC shit, but... He's got the M on his chest. He just got in the ring and he went to pin him? Alright. He's got the Incineroar drip. He does. <laughs> Mark's just watching this happen in front of him. Oh, big reversal from Fox McCloud. Huge! Is he supposed to be Incineroar? It kind of looks like Incineroar, like... It's his color scheme at the very least, Incineroar. Hakadoshi, thank you for the four years! Rabbit, thank you for the 83. Oh, up and over. Oh, Mark running around the ring to bitch slap Fox McCloud, all right. All right, who's up next? Oh no, Michio! Oh no! He's in. Oh, <laughs> he's dancing. He's having a good time. He's happy to be there. Oh, the predictions, by the way. I didn't read it. All-Star Zombie at 19, Aku at 9, Markiplier at 29, Fox at 12, Ghostface at 20, and Onomichio at 11. Aku winning here would be a big, a big pot for everyone who voted for him. Unfortunately, he was one of the first people to enter, so we'll see. Did I see the Dolphins-Broncos game? Yeah, we talked about it like hours ago when it happened. Fox throwing Aku out the ring like he weighs nothing, even though he's 12 feet tall. Mark apart, going up. Okay, he just broke his tailbone. He broke his butt bone. Dude, he just ruined his unus anus. <laughs> Subscribe for more jokes. Next person coming in. Next one in is Ghostface. What the so All-Star Zombie will be the last one in in the next 90 seconds. Oh, this is, this is impressive. All the way Inverted DDT. Everyone, honestly, even Fox and Aku is still looking pretty healthy here. Oh, so someone just spit in ghost faces. Someone did the mist. Was that Aku? Oh, getting slammed outside the ring. All-Star just has to watch. 
He is just a spectator right now. Oh, a big starter by Mark on Onomichio. All right, let's see. That's a long count. That took a little bit. Ooh, Aku, big reversal there. I think he was taunting as well. Jeez. All right, here we go. Final member, the All-Star Zombie. Here he comes. On his back. All right, Mark. The All-Star Zombie is already stunned. Hold on. Oh my God, All-Star Zombie's already gone. What a pussy. Why were you even here? Get out of here. Dude, he got fucked immediately. Yeah, the walk of shame. Get out of here. I'm not even sure the zombie did anything. Anyway, if you voted for him, that sucks. <laughs> oh, Onomichio's knocked out now. It's all kicking off. Ooh, Onomichio kicking out. Oh, huge reversal again from Fox on Aku. Ghostface taking a breather. For Aku? I don't know. Nope, he's still in it. Mark picking up the ginormous Onomichio. Mark thrown out from Ghostface. Huge special there from Fox. That should be it. Aku has been eliminated. Fox, Onomichio, Ghostface, and Markiplier are your last ones here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Fox is looking incredibly healthy, considering how long he's been in this match. It's actually impressive. Kane-esque. Ooh. And a rolling next snap. And he gets put into a bad spot there. We're getting into desperation mode for him. He's looking a little ruined now. Dude, that's an easy pin on Mark. What are you doing? You have to keep pushing I guess getting some health back. You you could oh, that might be it. That might be it. Nope. Only two. Dude, Fox is putting on a clinic. God damn. Ooh, now he's stunned. Hold on, hold on. Wait. No, I knew that wasn't it. That wasn't it for Fox. Oh, no, Michio, don't tap. You're better than that. Don't tap. There you go. Oh, Jesus, Ghostface. Frost, thank you for the 82. Kicked out again. Oh, he just threw him and ignored him. What a fucking Looney Tunes-esque wind-up by Onomichio there. You know, considering how long these guys have been in the ring and, like, wrestling at kind of, like, lowish health, 
it makes all-star zombie losing instantly even more embarrassing just like pokey made from the, the the rumble nope he wasn't stunned that's how he kicked out fox's health is more accurate to what i thought it would be a little while ago pokey did redeem true I, i'm not gonna give all-star zombie a chance he's not the queen of twitch oh what the fuck is onimichio doing oh that might be it what all right what's fox doing he did finger pistols is markiplier really reversing this on onimichio he might hold on no wow Jeez. Oh, no, Michio just is like crawling to the corner, like, have mercy. Ghostface, what What do you mean? There's, yeah, that wasn't even a one. These guys are going hard. They want a chance at the Poggers champion. Championship. What is this? Oh, that was kind of... Oh, wait, they're both stunned. Who's going to get counted? I think it's Mark first. He counted out. Oh, no, sorry, he kicked out. They both kicked out. Bitch, you got two hands. One, two, count with both. All right, Fox, that was good. Well done. I think Fox got bailed out there. Dude, Ono Michio is primed to be hit with a finisher. Oh, Markiplier's just, okay, hitting Ghostface in the liver. The referee's in the way! Oh, wow, Fox loses on that? All right, that goes Fox. I guess that was his neck, to be fair. Melee has been canceled forever. All right, no finishers live right now. Oh, a tap out? A tap out by Onimichio? No, not like this. Absolutely not. Bro, Markiplier's cracked right now. Okay, I don't know what Onimichio's doing. He's just having a good time. He's happy to be here. Big reversal. Right in the knees. Uh-oh. That might be it for Onomichio. That might be it. How many people has Markiplier eliminated? It's two, but like maybe three. Oh my god. It's three, right? He's gonna, he potentially might eliminate almost everybody. If Ghostface wins this, that'll be so sad. He's stalking his prey. All right, no, he's looking the wrong way. Oh. Outside? Can he do it? No, Ghostface still in. Oh, okay. Oh. The the pure power of Markiplier Fischenbach. Oh, that might be it. That might be it. Hit him with the stunner. Is Mark going to win? Mark, pin him! What's he doing? Oh, okay. Let's see. Oh, my God. Ghostface is still somehow in this. Hey, it might be time for 
Watch what it. up? His best move didn't get the job done. All measured up. Oh, Ghostface is going to need a hell of a rally. I don't know if he has it in him. All right, okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You don't want to see that. Markiplier doesn't even seem gassed right now. Okay. Ghostface showing some life. Showing a little bit of life. Good reversal. Oh, good block. Uh-oh. Okay. He missed the clothesline. Well done. He blocked the clothesline. Okay. Getting some defense from Ghostface. No shot. No shot. Ghostface does have a finisher, though. Ooh, right across the neck. That is what eliminated... Uh, was that Fox that got eliminated that way? Grab his dick and twist it. The old dick twist. All right, Mark is picking up momentum again. Mark has a finisher. I thought he was going to jump over him, but it looks like he missed. Oh, Mark is a little stunned. Or no, is that Ghostface? I think Ghostface is stunned. What was that weird, like, 90-degree spin he did? Mark's ready for him. Uh-oh. Reverse. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. He's not pinning him for some reason. Oh, he still has his finisher, I guess. Uh-oh. Oh, that might be it. Maybe. Well, he's not stunned anymore. No, no, no. Never mind. Never mind. The ref tried to get in the way. It's scripted. Good night, Rain Chat. Have a good night, CC. All right, we have two finishers on the board. This can go either way. Markiplier definitely deserves it, but Ghostface is still in it. Not giving up. Oh, he just tumbled. He's outside the ring. He's almost at full stun. I guess he's just going to let the stun bar go down. Oh, that might be it. That might be it. No, dude. No. He's still in it. He can't lose. Oh, that's it. That's it for Mark. What the Ghostface is the winner. What a fight. Dude, Markiplier always puts in his best effort, but he never wins. God damn. Feels bad. Feels bad. That was a good one. That was a good ending. I don't know why All-Star Zombie was there, but everything else was great. Everything was great. He was... I don't know why he was there. All right, so this one is for the uh, for the belt. Triple threats. Hell in a Cell. At uh, the UK. For the Bruvs. All right. Can I do... Two out of three falls. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now, this could be good or bad. We have no, we'll have no way to know. Uh, time limit? No, no, no limit. We'll, we'll let it ride. That might be a fucking mistake, but we'll let it ride. All right. So, of course, we'll need the champion, which is Bob. Bob. 
Then we'll have uh, Ghostface, who did win the last match. Love him or hate him, he did win. And then we'll have uh, Squirtle, who is, we'll say, redeeming his, his briefcase. Why is his goddamn picture so big? Uh, championship. This, of course, is for the Poggers Championship. The most important one. Um, predictions are live. Here we go. And there, once again, is your portrait, your picture. The ultimate belt. I think the, the next match we'll end on, I want to do tag matches today, but I got too distracted doing other stuff because we have the we have the proper tag championships and then the the Taco Bell one, but I'll fix that. Next time we play, I'll have to do like a tag tournament or something. I think the last match we'll do is an eight-person ladder match for the women's belt. That'll be what we end on. Because the Steelers game is going to start or has started, and I want to be depressed for three hours by watching my team not be able to move the ball on offense. We got some intros, though. So you guys got some time to get some drinks, walk around, stretch your legs, get a snack. There's Squirtle. <laughs> oh, he has a suitcase. That's funny. That makes it even better. I have to... Uh, we'll have to do another Money in the Bank as well. And I'll make it the... I'll make it the... Uh, or I guess, you know what I could do? I could do... The women's thing is a, a money in the bank Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match for the future. And a huge that could work. For the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. There you go. God, his weird furry tail. I know he has a tail, but it looks weird so furry. Just no emotion. Just walk into the ring with his suitcase. He's using it here. It's his chance at the title. He is physically prepared. He is mentally prepared. This man is ready for this title opportunity. Is he physically? I mean, he's a turtle, so I don't really... Can he... Can turtles get swole? They get bigger. I don't know if they get swole. Oh, I didn't give him outfit two. You're right. I forgot. Attire two is the Squirtle squad. I fucked up. Terrible streamer. L plus ratio. Better at dog bark. I'm so sorry I let you down. Oh, you know, Team and T are kind of jacked. You're right. All right, next up. What is this camera angle? Okay, thanks for that. Who is, who is this for? <laughs> Mouse POV? Coming at you live from Remy of Ratatouille fame. Oh, this is for Ghostface. That makes sense. There he is. This is a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. The fan favorite, or I guess fan hated. What's up? Here tonight. The winner of the Elimination Chamber taking out the real fan favorite, Markiplier, who we'll have to keep and give him some more chances, but I don't know, man. He gets so close, but still so far away. Oh, this is the long intro, right? Me going to the kitchen to get some water after Tina pegged me for 45 minutes. <laughs> Only 45 minutes, weird champ. Hold on. I got some time to check football scores. Uh, anything else crazy happened today? Let's see. Taking a look at the night games. Seahawks beat the... Pa Cardinals beat the Cowboys? Oh, that's cringe. Shout out to Josh Dobbs, though, getting a win. Former Steeler and James Conner. Former Steeler getting a win. Dude, sometimes the Cowboys are going to Cowboy. Uh, Chiefs massacred the Bears. Seahawks beat the Panthers. 
nothing too crazy. And then the Steelers will get eight yards of offense and hopefully be bailed up on defense. Oh, Jesus. Ghost. Oh, my God. All right. He's trying to fuck the ropes. Hey, now I know why this intro takes forever. He's trying to coom before the match. Oh, fuck, dude, the audience is feeling it. Holy shit. Some kind of cult like activity. The audience. Ghostface fans. Yeah, if you guys want to come back tomorrow, I'll still be streaming this intro, so. Come back same time, 2 p.m. Central. Oh, I think he's done. Okay. All right, who's that? There. <laughs> It's Kawami Bob. There he is. The, the Pog the champ himself. In at 220 Here we go. He is the prestigious champion, Bob the Thug Clown. Bob the Thug Clown. Chances here tonight. I love him. I'm not like everybody else, Cole. It seems like everybody's ready to write the champ's demise, but not me. Dude, he took out Goku Black. He did the impossible. Hell in the Cell match, baby. Hell in the Cell match. That belt looks so good. It really does. It's it's so it's so stupid. I love it. Usually I skip the intros, but we did one just to kind of see how it looked, and then obviously we have to with the belt and everything, it's so good. He did the impossible. He took out Goku Black. And yeah, I'm glad we did the entrances because the Joe Biden intro was incredible. All right, here we go. Here we go, baby. It is on the line. The challenger not taking their eyes off the championship. And the champ is staring daggers right back at the opposition. All right, we got Squirtle. Redeeming his money in the bank. We got Ghostface, winner of the Elimination Chamber, and the champion, Kawami Bob. Here we go. For the POG Championship, let's see what happens. Two pinfalls is what we need. Let's see how this goes. Let's see if they escape the cell. Let's see if they go up high. How many weapons are involved? Ooh. Ooh. Squirrel just watching, being a voyeur. Not grabbing a weapon or anything, just watching Kiwami Bob fuck up Ghostface. Holy shit. It should have been Markiplier. It should have been Markiplier. Squirtle just taunting. Who was it that escaped the cell and just left his partner to 1v2? Oh! Damn, the wall's open already. That was uh, Batman and Robin versus Kiryu and Majima. All right, they are out of the cell already. Robin is the one that climbed out. Still no weapons, but they are fighting outside the cage. Or the cell. Ooh. Please climb the cage. I'm begging you to climb the cage. I'll be so hype. Get him out of there. Get the trash. Oh, he's going for the he's going for the turtle. Oh, never mind. Just threw them both like nothing. Bob looking real good right now. He worked hard to get that title. He does not want to lose it. Oh, they're climbing. They're, they're all climbing. Let's go. They're all climbing. Uh-oh. Bob is hitting Squirtle off the side. Uh-oh. Ghostface is the king of the cell right now. 
Oh, no! There goes Bob. There goes Bob. Oh, he's getting right back up. That's not that high. All right, here we go. Ghost face is ready. Is someone going to go through the cage? Oh, don't fall off. Be careful of the edge. All right, Bob is up there. Bob is up there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Uh-oh, Bob. Bob's on the edge. Bob, you got to get to the center. Get away from the edge. Oh, they're tag team with ghost face. Oh, never mind. Maybe? What is happening? What the fuck? Are we... Hello? I don't... Even Bob is confused. Oh, he kicked the squirrel right in the mouth. Oh, ghost face. Be careful. Be careful. You guys got plenty of cage to wrestle on. You're still by the edge. Oh. Oh shit. Oh Squirtle. Oh oh Squirtle. He's okay. He's okay. Just nudge Squirtle. Hey, get the hell out of here. Oh Ghost Face. Ooh okay. Squirtle is back up. No longer stunned. Oh, I wonder if you can. I know you the pins. You can, you know, pins are anywhere. But does the count of the cage count? I think it does. Uh oh, oh, I thought he was gonna fall off. Oh, is he gonna throw him off? Whoop! Oh, he's on the corner. Oh, oh, Squirtle. Oh, Jesus Christ. Why am I anxious? Bob, what are you doing? Oh, he's like kind of doing a thing. All right. Oh, oh, ghost face. There he goes. There he goes. Jeez. He is going to take a while to get up, but thankfully they're still fighting up there so he can recover. What's up? It's like why he's falling. You hear it? What's up? He's climbing back up. He's climbing back up. Was down. That's funny. Good camera bit. Thanks, Kevin. All right. Squirtle is stunned. All right. Ghost face is back up. Going straight for the knees of Bob. Kwame Bob. Oh, no. Oh, no, Bob. He's just kicking him in the back of the leg. Oh, big breakup by Squirtle there. All right, Squirtle, doing a bunch of kicks. Ooh, good reversal by Squirtle again. They're not letting each other suplex each other, at least in the center. Uh-oh. Oh, all right, Squirtle's... Kwame Bob, what's your problem, dude? You're just throwing right hooks. Bro. So I think for this, I think you only go through the the cell in the center where they're standing, like those four panels. Because you got to be above the ring, I think. We haven't seen it happen. Oh, oh he almost fell off. Oh, there he Oh, no, he held off. He held on. Bro, Ghostface almost fell off again. Uh-oh, Bob's on the corner. He got out of there. Smart, smart. It was much more visible in the older games. Oh, like the, the breakable parts? Yeah. I think they were like a different color or something. Like maybe in the PS2 games. Oh, Squirtle. Watch it. Watch it. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Thank God for the invisible wall. Uh oh, oh, Kwame Bob. All right, they're back by the center. Oh, Squirtle's kind of getting it right now. Yeah, I like the ref down there. It's like... All right, guys, be careful, but have fun. Uh oh, oh, Ghostface. Oh, Ghostface. Oh, 
We got a bunch of finishers lined up, too. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This might be a pin right here. Let's see. Nope, guess not. I guess he doesn't want to pin up there. Or maybe you can't. Or he's just trying to BM. Or he just wants to make sure by hitting him with two of them. But Squirtle's back up. Ooh, okay, now he's stunned. Oh, God, go through the cell. That'll make people so happy. Go through the cell. I think it has to be a specific move, too. Like, maybe like a... Oh, it looked like he was peeing on him. That was weird. Like a power bomb or something. Ooh, they're close. The shell protects his back. Oh, ghost face. Careful. Yeah, it looks like the panels are, like, kind of giving way a little bit. All right, Ghostface, the only person... That's one. He needs two. You need two. Bob is back up. Bob is back up. Someone finally went through the cage. It was great. It's not over yet, but it's not looking good for Bob either. But Squirtle is back down. He's back down now. I'm not sure if they're going to climb back up. The action might stay in here, especially since Bob is essentially dead. Okay, that might be a pin for Squirtle. Nope. Ghostface is up. So I think the champion is just a fodder at this point. Okay, he's rolling out of the ring. He's rolling out of the ring to recover. Honestly, Squirtle has the most health to get back, potentially. Right, Bob is back. German suplex, but that's not all. Into a record lariat, what a combination! He's running. Oh, Bob is getting some weapons. What's Bob grabbing? He is grabbing the bat. All right. He's not using the bat. Surprise! Bob is walking. Same. Same. Oh! Don't worry, the Afro acts as a helmet. Oh, he hit Squirtle there. How did that happen? Oh, there goes the bat. Ooh. Oh, he's almost at full stun. Big reversal from Bob. Nope. Ghostface waking up just in time. Okay, Squirtle's gone. Bob is feeling it. The adrenaline is the only thing keeping him alive right now. All right, kendo stick by uh, Squirtle. Bob has two finishers right now, which could be big. And there he goes. Oh, no, he's still there. He's still there. Oh, okay. Pulling a prank. Reversal from Squirtle. Ghostface just... Bing chilling, getting his health back. All right, he's done. He's done waiting. Oh, he's going for it. But Bob is right there to break it up. Ghostface only needs one more pin or submission. Ghostface is doing live react content. Oh, 
Squirtle is out of the ring for a little bit. If Ghostface could stun... Oh, well, he might go for it here. Let's see. No. Kicked out. Kicked out. All right, Squirtle back in. Bob and Ghostface have finishers. All right, Ghostface slowly waking up. Oh, there goes my voice. It's fading. He's going to break that up. Ooh, right to the face. <clears throat> yeah, Bob has been put through the ringer. The ringer, the blender. He's been through a lot. The only person not fall off the ring is, uh, or the cell is Squirtle. Squirtle grabbing another chair. All right, Bob's like, I'm just going to walk over here. Hang out a little bit. There you go. He's getting some health back. He's morbing up. Oh, that might be it. Well, wait, I'm sorry. That might be a point for Squirtle. Let's see. No, Ghostface. Got up just in time. I love how Bob is the only one that's been pinned. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Bob? Wait. Oh, no point for Bob. No point. And look at the disbelief on the face of the champion. They both know what's at stake. Neither competitor is going to lose easy here. Just dished out his most devastating... Throwing them bows. He's thinking one more time will be the charm. A right to the gut. Oh, man, you can see... Haunting again. He's got, he's got two finishers. Bob is trying to make something happen. Oh, he's pinned. You got to get rid of Squirtle. Or he's stunned. He's not pinned. I'm sorry. And now the most dangerous area inside the cell. Caught square by the haymaker. This arena has come unglued. You can see the foundation shifting with every turn in the match. All right, Ghostface is about to get up. Big reversal. Tag with a punch. He'll take things into the ring. Oh, it's coming. Oh, he's through the cell. Damn. True. Well scattered reversal there. That you know, that did look like a heat action. You're not wrong. Oh, man. oh, oh they're going back up. They're going back up. Oh wait, they're gonna fight here. Hold on. Uh oh. Oh, Ghostface might take a tumble again. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, he's still hanging on. How nice of Squirtle to let him leave him up. Kiwami Bob's like, I don't know if I want to go up there, man. Last time I was up there, it didn't end well for me. Okay, Bob's up. All three are up again. Oh, he's like on the edge. Oh, Squirtle's on the edge. They are both stunned. A championship level move. Oh, yeah, I guess you can't pin up there because the AI doesn't seem to pin up there. Oh, okay. You broke up the move, Ghostface. What the fuck? Oh, God. Was that at me? He broke the fourth wall. There is a hole in the cell. That's 
you can kind of see it, I, I believe. It's right above them. It's like in the bottom right of the center. If that makes sense. The center four panels. Squirrel doing fucking gymnast. Oh, whoa, hey, 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 Squirrel, be, ca be careful. You almost gymnastic your way off the goddamn cell. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh, Ghostface. Oh, he's still on. I can't believe he's still on. Uh oh, Bob. Uh oh, Bob. You're fine. Yeah, you're good. You're you're fine. I can't believe Ghostface is still on. He was stunned that whole time. I can't believe like moves like that don't knock him off. I assume it has to be like a very specific spot of the cell or a specific move. Oh. Another one, okay. Oh, they're both stunned. Now what do you do? If you were in the ring or you were on the ground, that would be a win. Just fucking kick him off. Squirtle's kind of near the hole there. It's like the AI is confused. Oh, Bob is going back to his favorite spot. Oh no, I think we're gonna see the electric chair. Oh no, okay. I thought he was gonna drop him backwards to the hole. This entire arena is on the edge of their seats watching these two clash. Oh, what are they gonna do here? Oh, Come on. Move further up. Further up and to the left. Oh, oh gee, that he should have fell off. I feel like people used to fall off more in the other. Oh, oh yeah. God damn it. Yeah, I think in the older games they fell off more. I think it was easier to fall off. I think in 2022, it was easier to just walk off. I feel like we had a couple of instances where the dude just walked off on accident. I feel like it's very specific in this game. Oh. Oh, God. He's, like, right there. Oh, there's Ghostface again! <laughs> there he goes! He's not stunned, though. He's still not stunned. Well, not a full bar, anyway. That guy is winning. He's fallen off twice. Oh, is it Kwame Bob's time? No, I think Squirtle saved him. All right, Ghostface, no fear, coming right back up. They really like this bottom right-hand corner. I wish they would move to the left. Okay. Oh, I thought that would kick him in. Shit. Oh. Between the thighs, Squirtle? Okay. Bro, anytime Kwame Bob's about to go off, he gets saved. Incredibly lucky. Or maybe not. Hold on. Hold on. He should fall off right there. God damn it. You guys love this one panel so much. I beg of you, move. Move from it. 
clowns got magnet boots. All right, a little more to the left. A little more to the left. Oh, drop him in the hole. If only. If only. Oh, 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 Kawami Bob almost went through. Or went uh, over, rather. There he goes! Kawami Bob is down! All right, Kwame Bob's going to get up. Kwame Bob's about to come right back up. There he comes. Here he comes. No, Squirtle's the only one to not fall off. Oh, he just saw his up. Ghostface is gone again. He fucking tripped over his shoelaces. Squirrel, you gotta fucking take him out. All right, Ghostface for the what fourth time is about to climb. <laughs> He's coming back up. Oh, there's Squirtle! Everyone has fallen off at least once now. We need like more than, t we need like two people on the ground because I think they'll climb down and actually try to end the match instead of fight on top of the cage forever. Oh, oh, oh. How did he not, what? He was on the edge. Did he land on his shell? Yeah, he did. It broke his fall. He's fine. No, I don't think you can fall from corners. I think there's like an, an invisible wall there. You have to be more on the bottom or the top, top, bottom, left, or right. The corners, I think you're safe. Shout out to the ref. Just still watching. Still just hanging out, standing there. They're like magnetized to this little this corner. In terms of worst ideas of all time, fighting on top of the cell is right up there on the list. You can just feel the Just throw him off. That'd be so much cooler. Oh no, I think we're gonna see the electric chair. Nope. Oh, 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 my thought's going over again. Uh, Squirtle, he has iframes. There you go. You're good now. <laughs> he should have just flown off. No, you can't pin on the top of the sh the the cell, I guess, because I think they would have done it by now. They need to like two people need to be knocked off, or someone needs to go through, but they're stuck in this corner for some reason. They like love it here, but nothing can happen here. This is where we permanently live. $70 game, by the way. We might be here till tomorrow. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Well, it, this felt like it for the battle royale we had, or the fatal four way. And then eventually it ended, like very quickly. So, it might happen again. They're moving up, though. They're moving up. He's by the hole. Like, slam him in or something. No, that doesn't get it done. It takes a lot to knock them off, I feel like. They like stumble, but I guess then again, maybe not because Ghostface just walked off. So who knows? 
It's like very, very specific. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're moving. We're slowly moving up. Oh. Okay, ghost face more, more to the left, up and to the left. We're th not the corner, not the top right corner, please. Okay, all right, we're squirtless. Oh, fuck. Come on. All right, a little to the left. Are we getting, oh, shit, no. Not the other corner, not the other corner. Please, not the other corner. We're in the other corner. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. Well, at least it's a different spot. Okay. I don't know how that worked, but sure. Another finisher that's just going to knock him out for a while. Oh, you're so close. Oh, no, to the left a little bit. To the left a little bit more. Oh, if only you could fucking pin on top. Well, Squirtle's feeling good about himself. Still got no goddamn points, though. Oh, if only you were just to the left one panel. Oh, hold on. Bob is being, like, shifted over to where it's supposed to happen. Oh, just move over to the left a little bit. Move over to the left. You're so close. Yeah, Bob is getting collisions. Fuck, maybe I should have put a time limit on this if I knew the AI was going to be a little buggy. Yeah, I don't think you can even submit up here either. Yeah, he just, he just breaks out of it. Okay, hey, we're more to the left. Now go down. Go down. Go down. No, they're going to the other corner. They're going around the world, but it's just the corners of this fucking cell. Bro, bottom left corner? Bottom left hand corner? Guys, I think Markiplier would have won by now. I'm just saying. Mark would have won by now. <laughs> they need a fourth corner, they do. At this point, complete the circle or the square. Fuck, at this rate, this is going to be the last match. I didn't expect it to take this long. Especially when we got the one from Ghostface. Oh, God. he's on. No, don't go back to the other one. Don't go back to the other one. What just happened? He just glitched out and fell again, dude. What the fuck just happened? All right, that's what, number four or five? Just throw him off. Stop knocking him over. Oh, here comes Ghostface again. Here he comes. Here he comes. Can I track how long this match is? Uh, you, I think there's a way to put a timer on. I'm not sure if it tells you at the end, but in the VOD, because this this is going to be the last match now, because it is getting later than I thought. This, would, uh, this is taking longer than I thought, so it's getting later. I do want to see the Steeler game, and it, it already started, so. But these guys, these idiots, don't know how to get off the cage.
Oh, shit. Yeah, at this point, I won't even see the Super Bowl. The 2025 Super Bowl. Yeah, f getting knocked off the, the Hell in the Cell is way too hard, and the AI is just not good in these games to know, like, what to do. We got lucky the first time. I'm not sure if it's going to happen again. Come on, fellas. I want to see my wife again today. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're kind of toward the center. No, no, no. Back up. No, no. You're going back into the corner. This match will live in infamy. It will. Hold on. Hold on. Maybe. Maybe. Yes. No. Stop edging the center. Oh, they keep getting so close to the center. Fuck. Here comes another one. All these slams should be where the thing could break. I can't believe the heat zone for this match would be the corners and like the top of the, the, the thing, the cell. Okay. Okay. Jesus. And they get stunned so quickly now because they're basically zombies at this point. Yep, I'm, you're gonna do your finisher again that does nothing. Okay, he's stunned, great, now what? Gonna beat the shit out of him some more. I'm, tr I'm just watching, they're AI. I can't do anything. I mean, I guess I could mercy kill this, but. Oh! He went through! This might be it! Ghostface might get it! It's over! It's over! Oh my god! Here is your winner, and new! He did it! He did it, Ghostface! Holy shit! Triple threat match. Three superstars absolutely giving it their all, with one breaking away from the pack. There you go, greatest match of all time. I don't know about that. What a win! God damn! Highlight reel. Which corner were they in the most? Okay, that's not a highlight. Neither is that. Neither is that. Okay. Okay, there's one where he goes through the cage. Dude, he was like, I'm surprised that broke because he was like in the, he was barely on it. Maybe the game had enough. Well, there you go. Ghostface is the new uh, pog champ of the world. We're never doing Hell in the Cell again. At least, you know, not two falls because if the AI gets up there, they don't know what to do. Poor Squirtle. Redeemed his money in the bank and did nothing. I can't believe Ghostface won that, but goddamn, I'm happy it's finally over. We are going to wrap it up there. Oh, yeah, at least not a, not, not a three-way, not a, not a triple threat match, though, because the AI was turbo confused. Uh, we'll, we'll pick up, I don't know when we're going to play this again, in like three months or something, two months, with, uh, we'll do some more women's matches and hopefully some tag, I want to do a tag tournament, but we just went kind of long, and then obviously that match took uh, four hours, so. Uh, great sub Sunday. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. We got a lot of good clips from this stream uh, that will definitely, definitely make the comp. YouTube, I hope you enjoyed. I will see you. Uh, I'll see you soon. Not on Tuesday because I have off. Or I'm sorry, not on Monday because I have off. YouTube, I love you.